L O P P E and Poppy in the house. What's How going you doing, on, my brother? How are you? Hey, I'm all right, man. We had a little bit of snow flurries today. What? Oh, no. I was like, what? We're gonna get some snow. But then, uh, of course, they were saying um, we're probably not getting snow to the weekend. So <laughs> it didn't, it didn't <laughs> stick. Yeah, didn't they, stick. They didn't really stick. So I was like, see, now, fun, funny enough, we made, we actually meant to get snow on the weekend too. So yeah, <laughs> so we'll let's see. hope that it. Let's hope that it's it's. That's, yeah. be nice. Well, I, I definitely hope it doesn't snow the next two days because those are my days off and I got a lot of stuff to do. So <laughs> once I go out and do what I need to do and come back in the house, I don't care how much you can you can snow. It can snow in between. That's right. Let me let me be able to run my <laughs> errands and then it can snow all at once. Oh, man. But it's been really windy here, though, like before the stream started. And I don't know if you'll hear it later, but, you know, the wind was kicking something fierce. I was like, what the? Looking around, <laughs> my house is gonna blow away. What's going on here? It was, it was crazy. It was crazy. Oh, no. oh man. So yeah. But, uh, uh, how you been? Ah, good man. Good, good. Just, uh, just cold as per usual. Right, lot, right. A lot, a lot more wet the last uh, two days, but otherwise all good. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Why is my thing? Yes, <laughs> I wanted to ask you. I actually wanted to ask you. What What are you actually drinking? Is that is that is that wine or what are you drinking? Oh, uh, it's different things at different times. But oh, right yeah. now, I'm drinking um, Fireball. It's a type of uh, whiskey, cinnamon whiskey. Cinnamon whiskey. I hate yeah. cinnamon so much. Oh, I love cinnamon. I despise oh, every like. <laughs> Oh, it's big red gum. It's, it's horrible, it. man. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, are you excited for the Funko Fair, my man? Oh, absolutely. You're That's excited. Like, I'm a lot more Fair, excited. Hell yeah. I'm excited. A lot more excited than what I was in the beginning. Oh, they as are. You know. Okay. Uh -huh, go ahead. I'm sorry. As you know, I was a lot. Uh, I was. I was really heated. Yeah, and I said to you, I was, I was getting ready to like, oh man, I'm gonna rant all over that show. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, and then, uh, <laughs> as you know, my opinion changed immensely when they dropped that sneak peek. Yeah, I, I was feeling the same way. Like, I wasn't really um, upset. I was just kind of like, eh, nothing special. Okay, uh, nothing I've seen that I'm like, oh my god, I gotta get. But then they did the sneak peek, and they were like, okay. All right, all right. I'm excited now. There's a few here that I like. I mean, still nothing like super special, like oh my god. But I, I definitely got more excited, and now yeah, over the next looks, uh, you, seven days or so, we're gonna see. I think your I think your genre just hasn't hit yet. And as soon as you got something that it's gonna hit you, because yeah. as soon as I started watching the releases today and on the the uh -huh. sneak peek, I was like, bro, <laughs> this is not fair. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I suppose. Um, shall we look at the chat and then we move on? Absolutely. Oh, B I, I can see you aching. I can see you aching to look at the chat. Like, oh, I want to look at the chat. I, I want to shout the people out, man. You know how I am. I love spreading the love. I got Sean, you. You're ruining it, bro. You're ruining it. <laughs> What's up, Bees Popper? Thanks for showing up. Hey, How's Bees. What's How's going K? on? How was school today? Talk to me. Wanko in the house. Wanko Wayne has shown up. Eyes, Thank you for That's blessing amazing, us bro. with your Thanks presence, for coming. sir. <laughs> Mr. Tech Thank you for blessing us. While he's here, <laughs> Mr. Techbot. Ba -ba 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 Congrats hitting 1K subs, baby. Congrats oh, again, my, my bro. I can't believe it, man. I remember watching you when you were like around 200 or something subs. You've grown was... up. <laughs> he's such a big boy. <laughs> such a big boy now. I um I think I I subbed him when he was in I think it was in the region of five hundred five hundred fifty something. <laughs> so he, he's doubled or nothing, huh? Yeah, Mister Techbot, he did it. I'm so happy for him. Uh, trying to get drunk? No, I'm not trying to get drunk. This isn't enough to get me drunk. This this is this is Listen. about uh five six ounces. This is nothing. Listen, the only reason the show goes so smoothly <laughs> is because he is drunk, guys. <laughs> What are you doing? Why did the chicken did listen? You, oh, he's, he's trying to doing, jump. 
dad it's jokes broke. yet. Stop jumping the gun. I <laughs> uh, said, can I drink 10 White Claws? Actually, I've never had a White Claw, but What maybe? is a White Claw? <laughs> it's um, like a, a seltzer alcohol that they have over here. I've never okay. had one, but yeah, I'm, I'm willing to try. 10 in an hour? Um, if I did that, it would have to be on a Wednesday or a Thursday. So that way I could recover before I have to go back to work. Have to go back to work yeah. <laughs> Makes sense. Uh, DPJ64 waiting on cool runnings. Yeah, I heard those pops are supposed to be coming. So they might be I, on movie. I was day. shocked. I was shocked that there hasn't been cool running pops yet. Yeah. So they should be coming. They'll probably announce them on movie day. Um, you're welcome, man. Listen, I'm, I'm happy that you got there. And, you know, many more. Let's go. Wayne Coast said they grow up so fast. Yes, they do. <laughs> oh, white claws, no laws. Uh, Wayne Coast said a woman drink. White claws are a woman's drink. Listen, don't go there. <laughs> JK, Wayne Coast, and Tech by white, uh, white Claw Challenge. I don't know. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. Like I said, it's going to have to be a day where I don't have to work the next day. <laughs> What do you owe no and don't owe no nothing. So that's pretty much it. Uh, Beats Poppin says early morning there. Well, cheers to you, Beats Poppin. Early in the morning. Just early in the here. morning. I think it's around half eight time or something. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So that's all that's in the chat now. As new people show up, you know, I'm always going to shout them out. But Funko Fair 2021. So far, they've announced a few things. I mean, like we were saying earlier. I wasn't too excited. I mean, there were a few pops here and there. I was like, okay, I like those. But since they went through it, I've been like, oh, yeah, I want that. <laughs> yeah, I want that. <laughs> yeah, I want that. It literally, like, um, for what you're saying, what you got excited for in the sneak peek, it literally just took one glance. You're like, bro, <laughs> so excited. <laughs> I need it. Yeah. So we're going to do uh, boom. We're going to start off. Um, I know most of the people saw the, uh, the Funko um, sneak peek video they did. Um, actually, where's my, where's my thing? Where's my thing? I kind of took some snippet of the video and threw it together right there. Um, and these got me excited. The sodas. Like, it, uh, how many sodas do you have now? I think you got one now, didn't you? you I only one have recently. one. The Bob Ross. And yeah. um, when they first came out, I had saw them, and I was like, eh, I don't really care. But there are a few of them that I like, but I'm like, I'm not getting sucked in. And now they're coming out with more that I like, and I'm like, all right, I might have to get sucked in because I want that All Might. I might get the tick. Um, the Beetlejuice is nice. <laughs> so the, like, Beetle, oh, the Beetlejuice is really cool, yeah. Um, I definitely want to get Egon because you know they're going to do the rest of the Ghostbusters, and I like Ghostbusters. So I'm like, all right, well, let me grab the Ghostbusters. So I think what um, yeah. what definitely makes the Beetlejuice uh, I mean, one really cool is with, with his hands forward like that. That looks really cool. Yeah, and they have the glow in the dark chase. So it's like, all right. And then they have two question mark ones here. So I'm wondering. So is there two more sodas? Like, so that's really cool. I'm excited for that. Yeah. See what it I is. Mean, I'm pretty sure that more of them are going to come out. Um, if you go to Chalice Collectibles, mm -hmm. uh, scroll down, you'll see they got the All Might and the Beetlejuice already. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you could go over there and order them now. Those just came out with the um, Funko Fair. So I'm probably going to order these. And since they still have Raph, he was my favorite Ninja Turtle, so I'll probably get that. Same here. Same here. <laughs> They're the most and, badass cat in town. Yeah, and he wore red. I actually have some Psy like him is back there somewhere in the room. And I have my Harley, so I might get her. So yeah, I, I think I'm in the, on the soda game now. <laughs> they got me. They got me. So yeah, for sure. Like, look, I'm um, the thing I like about the soda is they don't do it. They do it in just so random. So, like, there's no actual genre that they pull at each time. It's just random. Right. It's just like, okay. You know, random it, it, characters. Yeah. It's like, here, we have, so, we have, uh, we like this one. We like this one. We like this one. So they just throwing them out. They, the only sets they really have are like the Ninja Turtles. They did the Ninja Turtles set. That's pretty much yeah. it. <laughs> For sure. 
Yeah, sodas are for sure on my list. Mine too. There's a few of them that I'm definitely looking at. Like, okay, I gotta get. You said twenty five dollars for a can? What? Listen, wow. is that is that American dollars or Australian dollars, bro? This yeah, you might have, yeah, yeah, you're gonna have to uh, clarify that one. But that's still a lot because well, over be here much. they're only like fifteen bucks. And you know you can get them for twelve in some places. So you see, but the thing is, you see, like, yeah, okay, yeah. So that's it's, a regardless, lot. it's still pricey, yeah. Yeah, that's pricey. Um, and another thing that uh, Funcon announced that they didn't announce. Let me see. Um, there's no day for it specifically. We were talking about it earlier with the Pop Rocks. But you know, listen, Michael. House, I'm not a Brett Michaels fan it by, by any means, but that is a really sick looking pop, man. <laughs> I like how that one looks. You know? That is a badass pop. Man. Get I love the positioning of the guitar. I love yeah. the cowboy hat. Yeah. Stella. It's so absolutely fantastic. Guitar crossbow. That that's an awesome looking pop. And Aaliyah, I'm definitely getting Aaliyah. She was my I girl. I knew you'd get Aaliyah, like um oh. yeah, sure. Oh, she was my girl. And Devo. <laughs> Who doesn't want Devo? Come on, whip it good. I'm definitely grabbing a Devo pop. I'm gonna probably get four of them. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Just like so I have the whole band. Because there were four. Oh, okay. I see. No, I don't. I don't follow that. So I don't know. Who... <laughs> They're old band. You know the song "Whip It," right? I, Whip I it good. Da, 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 da. Crack that whip. Da, 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 da. You don't know that song? I don't think so. Oh, I'm gonna have to send it to you on um on um through YouTube. Oh no! Oh yeah. no! <laughs> And then the new Britney Spears. Don't really care for it, but you my know, daughter loves it. She's Spears. just like, she doesn't know who Britney Spears is, but she loves it. But she likes the pop. <laughs> yeah. If anything, um, the first Britney Spears pop I was going to get, that was actually the first pop I showed on my channel in my first video. We were pop hunting, and I was going to buy it, but then I found other stuff to buy. So I, I put her back. And now I'm like, damn, I should have got it. Because <laughs> I'm not like a, a Britney Spears fan, but come on, it's Britney Spears. How do you not get that pop? Yeah, I think I think it'll hit a lot of people with the whole nostalgia thing. I'm sure. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Uh, it's a new Falcon for Falcon and when the soldiers that leaked. I haven't seen it yet, but hopefully I can see it. I find it somewhere. Yeah, uh, Beats Pop said Australian dollars. Cool, cool, cool. I'm I'm literally trying to um, avoid uh, spoilers. <laughs> Oh, you said Brett Michaels is missing all his ladies from Rock of Love. <laughs> <laughs> I never watched the show, but I do know the reference. That's funny. Oh, man. So, yeah, we got um, those. And let's see. Let me get back into it. Hold up. So they did the. I was looking at the map. And of course, on the map you see music because I just showed the pop rocks. But the, on the schedule, there's no music on here. <laughs> Day nine is DC. Over here, it's music. So, well, it's one, one, two, three, four, five, <laughs> six, seven, uh -huh. eight. You see, there's only eight uh, building areas. Yeah, plus the sneak peek because sneak there's opening nine. day. Yeah, opening day is sneak okay. Peek. Opening and sneak peek. Yeah. Yeah, day two is anime, three is sports and games, then Marvel, movies, TV, animation, Disney, and then says DC, <laughs> which I'm assuming is DC Comics, but here it shows music. Is there anything saying DC or any reference to something like DC on that picture? No. No. No, we on you see, The thing oh, is, I think them. maybe they just messed up a little bit because I can't imagine them not doing DC and Marvel together. Or what? Or that yeah, conflict? But, well, not really, because it's all comic books. So I guess you could have done it together, but I don't know. Oh. Somebody made a mistake somewhere, or they're doing DC and music together, which, again, doesn't make sense because it doesn't go together. It'd be yeah. making more sense to put DC with Marvel. But we'll see. Um, as most of you have saw, they have a lot of the new Mandalorian stuff coming. Um these are all from the first season, though, and they're oh, just they're dropping good. these now. So I'm wondering if because no, but isn't that one that uh, one next to uh, your man with the dark saber? Um, isn't that from the second fire? season? Well, in the first season, he got the rocket booster also. 
He's, that's not the one where he's holding the child, is it? I can't really. No, it doesn't look like he's holding. Oh, because that maybe when he first gets no. it, yeah. Yeah. So, um, I mean, even if this one is from the second season, like all of these are from the first season. I mean, I guess you could put this with second season, but he had the dark saber at the end of the first season too. So, I must say, out of these, this this first set of uh, key rings, the one with Grogu in the in the little pod looks really yeah. cool. And then yeah. I like the I like the nursing robot or the. Yeah, IG-88. That looks really cool. As, as a key ring. Well, IG-11, I should say. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. As I mean, I don't really, look really sick. Yeah, I don't really collect the pocket pops. Um, I only have two of them. And one of them I bought was Ant-Man because I wanted all the sizes of Ant-Man so I could have him like he's growing. But <laughs> I don't really collect them. But some of them do look cool. I, I don't really care for them. Of course, they got the Star Wars ones. Um, yeah. Again. I actually didn't really I, look at these ones, to be honest. I, I like how they look. I'm just not a pocket pop collector. I'd, so I, I, I'd yeah. say the bar, the what's it, the Boba Fett in the middle at the bottom. Mm-hmm. Uh, the Chewbacca looks really cool, mm-hmm. and the RTD two <laughs> like looks really cool. Yeah, and these all look pretty much like how the pops look. So they they're all similar to what the pops. I mean, of course, you know, I would get Vader, but I'm probably not gonna. <laughs> if I find one for a good price, like if somebody's selling one for cheap, I'd probably buy it, but. Yeah. Other than that, yeah, I'm not, I'm not messing with any key rings. This one I'm upset at. It's what? actually on for pre-sale, but yeah. it's the exact same Hoth pop that they dropped before. I looked at the old Luke Hoth uh, in his yeah. Hoth outfit. It's the exact yeah. same pop. The only difference is the old one has a black base, and this has a white base. And this comes with a pin. With the old one, of course, they didn't come with a pin. But it's the exact same pop. I was supposed to pull it up. The picture but i did so you have to trust me <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah for sure so i'm like how amazon gonna drop an exclusive pop that looks exactly like the old why the I don't know. base and a pen listen we don't know everybody's requests maybe someone was requesting it with the whites stand for some <laughs> weird reason who cares i'm just saying well, there could be anything to be honest i mean if anything i could understand if they did like a restock I'm not sure if it's vaulted or not. I should have checked to see if it was vaulted. But, yeah, it's the exact same pop. So, I don't know. Anyway. And then here go the Mandalorian minis. Now, I'm I'm not a mystery mini collector either, but I would go in for some of these mystery minis. These look awesome. <laughs> Especially these two down here. Oh, my God. I would love to get those. Um, I like the Fire Soldier. That looks really sick. Mm-hmm. And then obviously once again the Android just below him is really cool. Yep. My boy Quill. Oh, he's, I've spoken. Oh, yeah, I have spoken. Rocks, <laughs> I've spoken. He rocks, bro. Straight up. Yeah. So I would I would but, probably get a few of these if I oh, again if I saw them on sale. All of these are kind of cool, I suppose. They look kind of cool. Yeah. I mean, being Star Wars and being Mystery Minis, because we, we did a Star Wars Mystery Mini opening a while back, me and uh, Kate, so yeah, yeah, I yeah. would go in for some of these, but um, they don't come before regular size pops. But <laughs> No, of course. No, but they're almost the same price as a regular pop, isn't it? Yeah, sometimes they are. They're like $5 to $7 a box for one, so it's like, psh, I'd rather just buy Yeah, I mean, you buy two of these, you could buy, you could buy a new regular pop. Like it's... Yeah. Yeah. So I don't really go in on those. Here go the keychain, so you can see like size wise what they look like. And of course, they had to put one of their lounge fly bags back there and think they slid. Yeah, so yeah. <laughs> cross uh, cross uh, advertising. Yeah, and these here pins the are getting pins. big, man. Yeah, uh, I'm not a pin collector. Um, somebody sent me. Uh, I can't say somebody. Um, <laughs> Funko PDX, we did a, a trade, and he sent me a Princess Leia pin, which I like. I, I still have it. I'm not getting rid of it, but yeah, I'm not a pin person. Mm. Um, if somebody gave them to me, I'd take them, though. <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't get the chase with... Um, yeah, with Jabba. It's like it's like Jabba, faded though. or something. I don't know. I don't, I, don't really, I don't understand the logic behind him fading. Like He didn't fade in the movie, did he? He didn't no. cross... You didn't cross into a Thanos movie, uh, into a Marvel <laughs> right? movie or something. <laughs> so I don't understand what the chase is, so yeah. uh, we'll have to wait and see what it is to, to understand why this one's kind of faded out and that was not. I don't get it, but 
Yeah, not really Listen, in man, on the pins. The Star Wars fan doesn't get it. I think we're all going to be lost. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we all knew these were coming, the Valentine ones. I didn't know they were going to be a part of the Funko Fair, but we saw these I coming. Don't know, like, I don't think I can. I don't think I can get these, man. The same as the Christmas ones. Like, like, do you display like seasonal ones all year round, or you take them out during like, the season? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like it's, I don't know. For me, like, yeah. I don't know. They look cool. I'm not saying they don't look cool, but it's just right. And yeah, why I'm you not... make Darth Vader pink, bro? Come on, man. Well, they actually have the pink Darth Vader helmet. I don't know if you saw the helmet collection. No? Different artists did their rendition yeah. of Darth Vader's helmet, so they have all different versions of his helmet. Okay, so okay. it's not too far fetched, but. Um, yeah, I don't really care for these that much. Although I will get R2 and Darth Vader, but <laughs> I don't really care for them that much. I mean, hey, you got a significant other. Maybe you want to give them a, a pop, you know? Uh, let me jump in on the chat real quick while we, while, uh, yeah, Ralph Wiggum. Listen, I didn't know that they were dropping them today. They didn't make an announcement. So, I'm so like, that, what, what is that? That was the drop on the shop then, isn't it? Yeah, he said um, the Ralph Wig, but I was on the Funko shop and I didn't see any um, notification or anything that it was going to drop like that. So, okay, now that kind of um, surprised me. You're going to um, have to you're going to have to forgive me, yeah. But uh, can you remind me who Ralph Wiggum is? Um, hold on a second. Where was it we were looking earlier? Here you go. Where is he? Where is he? Is he on here? There it's boom. I don't know if that's Ralph, but I know he's Wiggum. But they had a different one. Oh, on Ralph is his son. Ralph is his okay. son. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm not a huge Simpsons fan, so I, I can't tell oh, you so all you... the characters. But yeah, they dropped the Simpsons pops on Amazon. I don't know if you guys saw these. Like these dropped on Amazon for pre release, and then they dropped the Ralph Wiggum on the Funko Shop. But I didn't know Funko Shop was doing a drop. <laughs> and I was on Funko Shop and I didn't see the drop. So I'm like, what's going on? But yeah, he dropped around noon and was sold out in 30 minutes. So it don't doesn't really matter to me. I, I'm not a Simpsons fan. It didn't bother me at all that I missed it. I'm just upset because if it was something I wanted, then I would have missed it. And that would have upset me. Oh man. Popping some pops. What's going on? Thanks for coming in. Pop and um, sun pops. Cheap pops. Cheap pops. What's going on? How are we doing today? How's it, bro? Who else we got in here? Is that it? Oh, OG pops and collectibles. Oh, you don't have to be sorry you're late. I'm just glad you're here. <laughs> We're just glad you're here. As long as as long as you show up, even if you just popped in to say hi and you, and you leave, I'm listen. I'm happy. We appreciate it. We appreciate you just taking the time to show up. Uh, Chase's kingdom. Hail to the Kingdom. Chase, my on, brother. So on the topic of Chase, to have you seen his latest video? Um, I don't think so. What was his latest, video? brother? You got to go watch it. Really, really sick. Really, okay. really awesome. Okay, I got to watch your latest video, Chase. I probably saw it. I mean, I, I watched it through a bunch of videos yesterday where I was just kind of going through, going through comments yeah, and going. Yeah, yeah. Through. So I probably saw it yesterday, but I, my brain is fried. He said it's terrible. It's, it's, terrible. <laughs> it's bloody brilliant, man. It's really cool. So we'll see. We'll see when I get there. Pro props um, to you, Chase, my man. Yes, yeah, Chase's kingdom. Thank you for showing up. Um, all right. Here we go. Okay. Guys. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. You know I'm a Star Wars fan. And Indeed. I they were going to do Rise of Skywalker Pops because, you know, that's the latest movie to come out. They ain't really do that many Pops from it. Kind of upset that they didn't have, like, a, a new Finn Pop. But this Ben Solo, while it's rather plain, it it's the scene from the movie where, you know, he turned on, I mean, I hope everybody saw it, unless, uh, if you didn't, then spoilers, where <laughs> he turned on his Knights of Ren and Ray had just handed him the blue lightsaber through the Force Dyad. He kind of did that bow thing. So yeah. that is why I love this pop. Because <laughs> it's just, you, you see it and you go immediately to that scene. So I'm glad they did this. The Ben Solo pop. This is when he turned back to the good side. But you and see, now that's what a pop should do, isn't it? Especially right. if it's of a moment. Right. You should see it and you should go, okay, I get it. I know. Bam. Right there. Yeah. So that one, I definitely want. Um, 
I want Ray with the yellow lightsaber, mainly because, you know, it was kind of like the closing um, of the movie, the ending of the Skywalker saga with her having her yellow lightsaber. Um, this one, I don't really care for, but considering that it's the opposite of this one, yeah, I'm probably going to get them both because, you know, I have to have the pair. Just like with the Emperor shocking Vader. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Emperor shocking Ray. So, you know, yeah, got to get it. And then this guy in the middle, the 10 inch Babu Frick. <laughs> now, 10 inch Babu Frick is pretty much life size compared to how big he was in the movie. <laughs> you see, what I like about the pop is I wouldn't go out to buy this pop, but the, the, if someone had given it to me, I'll be really, really stoked to have it. The amounts of detail and just like look at the guy's eyebrows, his whiskers, yeah. his, his pose with his hands. Yeah. Freaking awesome pop, man. Very yeah. well designed. Yes, looks very much like he does in a movie. And in the movie, he was hilarious. One of the best parts of um, which one was that? The Last Jedi he was in? No. It was Rise of Skywalker. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, I definitely want to get that. Um, not sure if I'm going to buy it, but if I see it and, you know, I, I, we'll have to see what mood I'm in. <laughs> I'm busy. I'm, I just definitely. I just glanced over to uh, DDP, uh, DDP, DPJ's um, comment there. He says it's actually bigger than life, what they call life size. Jumbo That's why sign. they call it Jumbo. Now, okay. if you had a look at the sneak peek in the Godzilla and what you call it, uh, pops came out. They said yeah. jumbo pops with that, and then I was excited because that would be a really cool 18 inch pop. So but these are 10 inch. They say 10 yeah, inch. 10 inch, yeah, it says 10 inch. So I think. Do they say anywhere there's something about jumbo at all? No? Not on the, not on this picture. No, no. But I'm almost certain they actually did say jumbo, isn't it? I don't know. I have to go back and watch it. Yeah, um, I have to go back and look at it again. But if they did these at 18 inch. I don't know. Those I might, would be I, I, sick, bro. Yeah, I, I would probably get them. I mean, I want to get the 10 inches because, come on, it's Godzilla and King Kong. I mean, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm going to be so broke. <laughs> I know. I don't know how we're going to do it, man. I don't know how we're going to do it. But, yeah, but, um, but yes, yeah, very good detail on that that pop, like, honestly, bro. It's yeah. Fantastic. But you want yeah, to say? Wondered, I mean, we'll have to see how I feel when I'm in store, like, if financially I'm like, all right, I'm just gonna do it, or if I'm but listen, not it, it in does, a mood or whatever, we'll see, we'll see. It does change when you actually see it in real life, as opposed to a picture. Eh? Yeah, a lot of them I have felt that way, where I'm like, yeah, I don't really care, and then I see it, and I'm like, yeah, I'm getting it. Because just like the ten inch Mando, I had no interest in getting. It. I was like, oh, okay, ten inch Mando, yeah, whatever. But then I saw it, and I'm like, yeah, I got it. <laughs> you gotta get it, yeah. <laughs> Uh, here go get more of the pocket pops. It's pretty cool looking. There we go. Oh, bro, that they actually made. looks really cool. Ah, oh, I want that. I definitely want that. Oh, I gotta get that one. <laughs> that is really sick. Said, Wait, that Ben Solo is already sold out on Amazon. It is. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Where is he? Okay, I'm not gonna find it. No, he's somewhere. He is somewhere. He's somewhere. Hold on. There he is. Hot Topic. I don't think he's sold out yet. Well, not on Hot Topic, at least. Because pre-sale, yeah. You can still add is, the bag. Is he a like... Hot Topic exclusive? No, I don't think he's a Hot Topic exclusive. Uh, okay. Yeah. Because most of these um, pops that they've shown, they're not ex exclusive to anywhere. Most of them. So... But what I love is that right now, Hot Topic is having their hot cash redemption up until, I think, the 26th of January. And on a lot of them, they put that on there because they know <laughs> I was going to take full advantage of my hot cash and get this. those bastards. Um, anyway. <laughs> uh, X, what's up? What's going on, X? You said Ray Next, would be oh. He's not. She's not going to be a Kenobi. She's a Palpatine. <laughs> so you can call me DDP. <laughs> You're a wrestling fan, so they take it as a compliment. <laughs> but your pop said you can call me DDP. <laughs> <laughs> nice one, bro. <laughs> oh, he said he sold out on Amazon, but still okay. All right. Well, Amazon's probably one of the most popular, so a lot of people probably hit them first. But to see the thing is with um, pre-sales, um, Amazon 
I've gone on Amazon and ordered stuff from Amazon and then ordered a similar thing from somewhere else. And Amazon takes forever to get your stuff, like forever. So I don't even go to Amazon for pre-sales, only if it's an Amazon exclusive. Other than that, I, I don't really mess with them unless it's the last place that still has what I'm looking for. But yeah, I can't mess with them. Um, anyway, back to the uh, – okay. Um, there's a bunch of shirts. I don't know if anybody cares about the T-shirt. I mean, it's Paka Paka. I don't really care about Paka Paka. This is that new food line thing that they brought out, isn't it? Yeah, my daughter knows about Paka Paka. I don't really mess with it. Um, and most of the T-shirts for Paka Paka, I don't care. Um, if you guys out there like it, I'm not disrespecting it or anything. Just not my thing. <laughs> uh, well, look, I'm, I like the design of the shirt. I like the colors and that sort of thing. But otherwise, I'm not going to go all out to buy it. Yeah, exactly. So it's still waiting on B Rabbit from Amazon. Yeah, Amazon. They take forever to ship. <laughs> take forever to ship stuff. Um, uh, yeah, t shirt, t shirt. See more pocket pocket t shirt. I mean, a lot of the designs look cool. And it's, the blue it's one looks really cool. Yeah, it's like if it was something I knew about, I'd be like, okay, I'll get that. But yeah, not something I know about. Not interested. And then they have the plushies, which I'm sure some people like if you're a fan. Here they are. <laughs> All right, into Harry Potter. They're dropping now, this is, new Patronus pops. This is really cool. I want to get the stag. Yeah, this one is um. This is the female Patronus. This is, yeah. Uh -huh. So I want to get the male stag. That's not. It's not in this line. It came out already. Oh, okay. The stag. I really want to get. It looks really, really sick. Cool. This is Dumbledore's Patronus. Um, I would actually get this because I like the phoenix and. Yeah. yeah. That that um like crystal bluish um mold that they use. I like how they look. I've seen other Patronus. I'm like, oh, they look cool, but not really interested. I would get this one. Yeah, this is another picture. Of a, a nicer look. Yeah. Oh, it looks it looks a cr like crystal, bro. It looks sweet. Yeah, yeah, they look good. It's just that I'm not that much of a Harry Potter fan to get them. I mean, I would get this one, <laughs> but. You know the rest of them like they it look looks cool. cool. I think it's I think it's just the way it's the the molds made. I think. Yeah. And then uh, of course I don't know what that tweet was about, but I skipped it. Here go more of the Valentine's ones. You better look at them. Okay, now day two. Here's, here's where the fun starts. The fun but be, begins. Before before, before you go there, is there anything yeah. else you want to touch on on regards to the sneak peek? Um, let me see. Well, what I know I posted some stuff. Um, the sodas. We talked about the Godzilla. Oh, Shall we speak about the wrestling quickly? The wrestling, yes. Um, well, we knew this. The wrestling we knew that's Stone Cold and The Rock. They put a the question rock. out there, but we know it's The Rock. We saw it already. Um, yeah. I don't have the picture, but I know that's The Rock. Now, this is China. We know that. This is Stone Cold with the belt. Mankind, which we didn't know about, at least I didn't which know about. I didn't know about it, and I almost fell on the floor when I saw it. Right. When I watched this <laughs> peak, I was like, Ugh! and then I right. saw the two silhouettes, and I thought, no, but that's not the ones that right. means there's more. And I got right. so excited. I was like, what are they doing? Right. So one of them, um, hopefully I can find the picture again. Where, where, because <laughs> I don't remember where it went. Come on, go back. Nope, not there. Not there. Not there. Not there. Not there. Not there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to go back. There it is. There we go. Now the, that's the bottom. Now, that is so sick. Now, shall we get into a... You noticed the problem immediately when we first yes. started speaking. Yes. Right. Yeah. Now, can, this can would... anyone uh, see what the problem with this is? <laughs> hit, hit, hit it up in the chat. We'll give you a few seconds, like... A few minutes or a few hours. No, a few minutes. Yeah. No, it's a few seconds. A few hours. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, you seconds. know what? We'll come back in a couple hours. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the problem with this pop, um, since no one's commenting, um, <laughs> <laughs> is they got – where's the belt? Come on. It's where's the championship? And no championship belt. Okay. Now, this could just be a background picture somebody put to Post it. it. But That's not the reason we're getting to it. Still, Eddie Guerrero, you finally drop his pop. He should have the belt. Okay, so no no, the, the reason I 
bonded about is if you have a look at the pin that's coming with it. No, I WrestleMania mean. Oh, 20. WrestleMania 20, right, the pin, exactly. That is where he, he, he defended that. that title at WrestleMania 20. It was the phenomenal moment in the ring where he's standing there where uh, Chris Benoit joined him in the ring. Yeah, they put him up on the shoulders and stuff. And that they one. embraced because Chris Benoit at that moment won the heavyweight championship. Oh, okay, right, right, right. And the two friends finally at the top of their career, supposedly. Yeah. Right? So for me, them putting that pin there kind of does – They it's like an in, incomplete job. But right. Right. the pop looks sick. Yes, I definitely want that. It looks – I love that they just didn't do a default pose. They did the, the hand to the side. That's yeah, just, that, that look, that's what he did. So it's like, all right, that's Eddie Guerrero. That's his The pose. highlights in the hair. Yeah. <laughs> The only exception is it kind of looks like he's got short spiky in this. Maybe it's just from the way the picture looks. Right. But then you know absolutely the brilliant. Holes, you know, they, they can and then, do um, so much. So. I don't mm-hmm. think you can see, you can't see it because of the banner there, but his, shoot, his, his boots mm-hmm. is the gold boots. And that's really, really sick. And they actually, yeah, yeah, they got the gold. <laughs> that's absolutely amazing. I think uh, this shocked me. When I saw it, I saw it accidentally this morning and I was like, yeah. bro, I can't believe it. Finally, yeah. uh, Eddie Guerrero pop, and it looks sick. Yes, and and the thing that uh, we talked about earlier, though, I can see them doing either a chase with the belt, or they're gonna drop another Eddie Guerrero in the future with the belt. So that's probably the only reason why they didn't do a belt. On to be show. honest, part of me hopes that they don't do it as a chase, but just as another variant or something. That'll be easier to get it because I yeah. would really want that damn belt. Yeah, right. Uh, the title <laughs> that 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 um that pop with the belt and uh, and part of the reason also is it's because my uh, the the undisputed championship is my favorite title in wwe yeah, it's a, history it's, a, it's a really class championship yeah. i mean i'm a fan of the smoke and skull myself but that was nice and the old one with the the eagle one that had the wings yeah I the like wing that diggle, yeah. yeah. okay let's see but yeah as far as um in regards the to the wrestling pop, I was blown away. So I thought, no, that's amazing. And uh, one thing I did forget to mention to you before the show is Raw Pops. They made they made the emphasis on Raw. Yeah. That's so it for probably, Raw, I believe they said. So they're probably going to do a, a set of SmackDown Pops. A think. set of SmackDowns. So does that mean there's going to be two, four, six, eight SmackDown Pops? Is there going to be a pop? Is there going to be a SmackDown ring with two Pops in it? I don't know, but you know, I'm, I, I'm like, I'm like, oh my god, what are they going to do? Um, see, uh, but in, uh, in your opinion, if they had to, though, who do you think would be the two wrestlers in the ring if see, it was a SmackDown ring? See, if they weren't, if they didn't already do The Rock, um, I don't know if I can necessarily say this is SmackDown, but a WrestleMania moment was yeah. The Rock versus Hulk Hogan. Because remember they had the epic stare down in the ring, and it was just so exciting. That was when it was Hollywood Hogan, isn't it? Yeah, Hollywood Hogan. Like that would be an awesome wrestling that would be a ring moment. Cool, cool moment. Um, I but, can picture if it is if it is the SmackDown ring. Mm-hmm. I'd say it's definitely, possibly, uh, most likely, if it does end up coming into fruition. <laughs> definitely, definitely, possibly, most likely. <laughs> Hopefully, it does. <laughs> just trying to just trying to push the positive there. Um, Undertaker definitely being one of the guys. Yep, Undertaker. Yeah. Uh, yeah SmackDown yeah. always been his yard all over the years. So I would say definitely. Yeah. But who would be? Who would you say would be awesome standing across from Undertaker? I don't know, man. I mean. I'd say one of his top SmackDown cool. rivalries would be with uh, Brock Lesnar. Yeah, I guess that one would be cool too. I don't, I don't really care for Lesnar. See, the thing is, if they didn't do The Rock in this one, he should be in a SmackDown one because that was his show. He basically named it. They named the show SmackDown because he used to always say, lay the SmackDown. Yeah, for so, sure. For sure. But since he's already in the Raw ring, I don't think. They'll double. Well, I shouldn't even say that. They would double dip on the rock, but <laughs> yeah, sure. I wouldn't want them to. So yeah, I guess I guess Brock Lesnar, Undertaker. Yeah, 
Yeah. I could be. I don't know. I'm just. I'm just. I'm hitting a blank at the moment on who else can be with the Undertaker. Just assuming that Undertaker is definitely going to be one of the guys in the ring, right? If there's a second ring, and pops it. There's a, also one here that's not pictured. This one we assumed was The Rock holding the belt, but remember they're supposed to have an Edge pop too. See, the thing is that that figure doesn't look like to seem to have long hair. Now, right. I thought maybe they're just doing default. And then when I saw the Eddie Guerrero looking exactly like the silhouette below. Right. Then so, uh, we're assuming this is The Rock. So they did a rock in the ring with Stone Cold. And you see, the thing is, the we're going on this assumption. I think you mentioned earlier, if they got Stone Cold with the belt, they got to do The Rock with the belt. Right. And would it be the Brahma bull belt? Probably, yeah, because he did yeah. have his own unique belt. So, yeah. I so, I'm, I'm probably leaning towards that. I could see so, that, yeah. yep. But, again, they had they showed that there was a picture of an Edge pop that leaked. So, but you yeah. know what? I think Edge is most probably going to be part of the SmackDown line. SmackDown, right. Okay. And the same with McIntyre, because McIntyre was big on SmackDown. Right, okay. Yep, that makes sense. And the same with that stupid other pop, Otis. With the briefcase money, oh, the big briefcase. <laughs> out of all the pops they could have made, Otis with a freaking briefcase. Come on. <laughs> anyway. Oh man, yeah. But let's see. Uh, let me hit the chat real quick. Uh, let's see. We missed a lot of lot of stuff. So yeah. you guys are really going now. <laughs> I said there's no comments now. Everybody's chatting up. Uh, we go. Where were we? Where were we? Where were we? Okay, Ben Solo. Jump pops in the house. Thanks for showing up. So happy that you could be here with us. Thanks for um, coming, bro. Thank you for coming through. Also, I just pops. recent. I recently just subbed to him. Actually, Isn't cool. It? Did you hit three hundred? Because uh, I shouted out Jim pops. Was trying to get him to three hundred. He was at two ninety nine. Uh, Is it guys? If you haven't uh, subbed to Jim pops, get him to three hundred in the chat yeah. now. Go have a look, bro. If you're not subbed to him. Go have a yeah. look. Bro. Go hit up Gem Pops. Awesomeness, man. Yeah, he was at 299 yesterday. So I hope you got over 300. Um, let's see. Uh, the Tenant Superman just went back up on what? Hold up, guys. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Hold on. Um, vamp for a while. I got to get a Tenant Superman. I got to buy it now before it sells out, sells out again. I'm not joking. I'm ordering it right now. If I can. Okay, the D D D P J said he's at 341. He went to 341 from 299 a day ago. Damn. That is that is sweet, man. That is awesome. That's okay, let's awesome. try to get him to 350 then. Yeah, let's get him to 350. Holy crap! I'm absolutely proud of you. Oh wait, I just realized I'm. I can't. Damn, you guys would have sold my credit card information, all that stuff. Damn. <laughs> Where the hell's the tenant sewer, man? I'm looking for it. I know I shouldn't be doing this during the show, but come on, man. That's okay. I, carry I, on I, then. I'll carry on with the chat then. Let's see if I can <laughs> let's see if I can work some magic here. Oh, it's out of stock. Sold out. <laughs> it's Sorry, man. out of stock. Um, man, that was less than ten minutes, bro. You didn't stand a chance. Oh, for thirty bucks as well. Bro, I didn't even get because I signed up for the in stock alert and they didn't tell so, me. To, so listen, would that email. be a chance of a chase too? Or would you have to buy the chase separately? No, you yeah, get a with chase, chase with chase. Yeah, um, yeah you yeah, get yeah. a chance for the chase. I want that chase. Oh, that chase looks so awesome. Yeah, he'll hit the stores soon for sure. Oh, jeez. Yeah. How's it, Funko ah. PDX, my man? Are you broke? Gone in ten minutes. Damn. Funko PDX, thank you. Thank you for showing up. Appreciate it. <sighs> I'm depressed now. Yeah, let's finish talking about this fair. Um, <laughs> <laughs> You'll get another chance, man. You'll get another chance. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm just, I don't care. I, I'll get another chance. But thank you for letting us know that. Um, I'll, I'll have to keep my eye out. So, day two anime. No. I'm going to say this right at the start of this segment here, right? I'm an anime fan. You can see about my middle shelf over here and my nice big 10-inch uh, All Might. Mm -hmm. They got to stop making Dragon Ball <laughs> Z pops. They're just, it's just, it's getting ridiculous now. Like, um, 
someone posted on the actual uh, Instagram tweet or Instagram post or whatever. We've got fifty Vegetas. We've got fifty Gokus. <laughs> you know, it's just it's too much, my man. I I think it's no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but see, the thing is, as long as they're selling, they're going to keep selling, making. They're going to keep making. That, that's it right there. Thing. But listen, I don't even think that's true because nobody's buying Fortnite pops and they keep freaking making them. Somebody's buying them. <laughs> I think I think it's TechBot. TechBot, who, who doesn't like Fortnite? It's a TechBot. Yeah. yeah. I think TechBot, TechBot is buying Fortnite. them and he's a secret for, a secretive uh, Fortnite collector. Yeah, yeah, I think TechBot's uh, buying up all the Fortnite collectors. Well, not all of them, uh, but he's definitely Fortnite buying it. <laughs> Are you going to pick up the Mandalorian Mystery Mini bundle that's being sold? There's two different ones. Um, I'm not really huge on the Mystery Minis. Um, if I see the bundle, uh, depending on where I get it from, because, I, I mean, I got some hot cash, and um, I'm about to jump on Hot Topic either later tonight or tomorrow, throw a bunch of stuff in my cart and get busy. So <laughs> if they have it, then um and Sorry. i don't have a bunch of other stuff that i want then yeah i'll probably i'll probably grab them but i'm not too big on the mystery minis i like them but yeah probably not gonna really invest in them uh all right oh, so sorry. dragon ball z they have a new cell which that's first the only, reason I, the, the only reason i know is because people talk about cell and i'm like okay i know who cell is Okay, so that's, that, that's that's first form, yeah. All right. Um, I don't really care for any of these, but I do like Diamond Pops. So if I see this one at Hot Topic, I might get it because <laughs> I do yeah. like Diamond Pops. And the Glow in the Darks, like Glow in the Dark Pops tend to go up in value. Yeah, yeah. Uh, especially Dragon Ball. So I would probably mm. get it, um, depending on if there's other stuff that I want or not. But yeah, I'm not huge into Dragon Ball Z. So I probably won't get any of these, but you know, if I do get one, most likely I'll get this one because it's the diamond, and I like the diamond pops. For sure, I see what you're saying. Yeah, um, there goes some more. Yeah, some more. I'd say the way uh, the red rocket guy on the bottom right there, mm -hmm. he he's made well. He looks very cool, the mm -hmm. character, and the same with uh, Kami on the far left. Mm -hmm. Yeah, looks cool. The pop looks cool. I won't go buy it, but I'm just saying I'll give their props because it looks cool. Isn't that like Piccolo? Uh, base. It's yeah. It's they both the same. The Mackin race. Yeah. Oh, okay. Like I said, I don't know much. About and they that. they become the same person eventually down the story and stuff. Yeah. Very cool. Spoilers. <laughs> no, <laughs> listen, bro. If you haven't watched that part of Dragon Ball Z, then <laughs> I'm just saying because other people, you know, other people might not know. I don't know. Oh, no. I think that's <laughs> that was like that. That was a really known thing when I was in high school, and that's like, oh, okay, years, all right, years okay. ago, <laughs> in a distant galaxy, far away, far, far away. Okay, so there's, there's the there's the regular version of that cell. Okay, that this one glowing the dark. No, no. So remember the first cell we saw was a glow in the dark. Now that's the regular. Okay, version. that's oh, okay. These are regular. All right. Yeah, so and then you got Frieza in the back right corner, top right corner, right. which okay. really looks cool. I like the stance, but it's not something I'm interested in getting. Mm -hmm. And then you got Prince Vegeta as a young person, I presume it is. All right. On the left, wow. and then yeah, and that's that's Goku and Vegeta merged on the right of that, and then you got the normal one of the. Glow in the dark and the glitter version at the top. Right. Okay. All right. But yeah, just duplicates <laughs> of the exact same pop over and over, like. Yeah. I mean, I do like Vegeta. I like the character. Like I said, a friend of mine. I like, Ve watch, and I like I Vegeta too, but there hasn't been a really like, decent one out of him, to yeah. be honest. Yeah, the I actually had um, the over nine thousand Majin Vegeta. I bought at New York Comic Con years mm -hmm. ago. I bought two of them, and as soon as I got off the line, a dude offered me a hundred dollars for one of them, and I was like, here. <laughs> like uh, I wasn't really a, a collector back then. I was like, I knew what pops were, and I had won the lottery to get one, so I bought two. And somebody offered me a hundred dollars off jump for one. And I was like, here, <laughs> I sure, man. I just made my money back. It. You want to, you want to spend a hundred for it? Sure. So I was like, all right, um, all right. All right. Now we have I, Toki Doki. I have I no have idea. No idea what. No are. idea. 
Um, no idea. I, I wonder if K is still here. K, are you here? If you're still here, tell me what are these? I have um, no idea, but I do like this black one though. <laughs> they look kind of cool. Some of them. like that that one you're pointing at looks cool, but mainly this because of the cool. guitar, I think maybe. Yeah, it's like punk rock rabbit whatever it's i don't know what it's supposed to be i have no idea what any of these are but if i saw this and it was priced properly to where i thought it was worth it i would probably buy it because it looks pretty cool mm. the rest of them not so much but yeah, Tokyo, <laughs> if anybody not knows what it is tell me let's see uh okay another question how many grogu funko pops do you own which ones are you missing <laughs> um the grogu pops i've I'm, the only one I don't have that I really want is the one with um, with him like concentrating using the force. Uh, so what is that? And the know. one with the frog in his mouth. I don't really care for the one with the frog in his mouth, but I don't have it. So I know why you're asking. <laughs> but yeah, um, the one where he's concentrating, I think that's the Walmart exclusive. I want that group. Yeah, the black one, this black one over here. This it looks so cool. So anybody who knows what Toki Doki is, let me know. But there you go. They got some Toki Doki stuff coming out. Next, um, actually I'm gonna go a couple pictures down. To see all of them. There you go. These are Knights of the Zodiac. I remember seeing these and Did you I ever watch the show? I never watched the show. I watched it, and I think I didn't finish watching it, but I watched it, and it wasn't a bad concept, I don't think. Yeah, it was a show I was definitely interested in, because I was like, okay, it looks cool, but I never watched it. But seeing the pops, I I would buy these. Like, <laughs> I have no idea what the show is about, but they all look so freaking <laughs> To be honest, I wouldn't buy it because it kind of looks like you have to have all of them. You'd feel you have to have like one each of the, all the Zodiac, you know, like. Well, yeah, you know. You know what I mean? So I don't know. On the Zodiac, yes, you would probably have to get. All it's kind of like a completion completionist nightmare, almost. You know. Yeah, but see, that's the thing with me. I'm not a huge completionist, so I don't care. Yeah, yeah, no, for sure. I'll but just... if you are, you like. All yeah. of these pops, the same with the Dragon Ball Z now, and the next few anime lines coming out now. Right. If anything, absolute it's... anime completionist nightmare because unless you got a lot of money, you're going to be broke all the time. Yeah, yeah, you definitely will. Um, as far as the Zodiac ones go, um, I don't know which these are supposed to be. If it follows the American Zodiac, Chinese Zodiac, whatever, but I like this one in the middle. <laughs> I like how it looks. <laughs> I like this one up here. And I like this one here. These two, I think, are cool also, but don't care too much for them. I guess if I saw them in person, because they're definitely cool designs, but I like the three at the top more than those two at the bottom. Yeah. But don't get me wrong. They're very nicely designed. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And if they go by American Zodiac, then, of course, I'd have to get the Pisces, because I'm a Pisces. And then I'd have yeah, to get the sign for my kids. Pegasus. <laughs> Pegasus is the middle one, I think. It's this meant one? to be, I think. Yeah. yeah. Right. The main character of the story. And then this one... Um, I don't know what this symbol is for what company, but it's an exclusive gold one. Which yeah, so that's the biggest this one as well, but just the gold oh. version. Yeah. So that's this one. Yeah, that's that one. So basically, you got like the different tiers of the armor. So oh, that's obviously okay. so the silver, up. I can presume, the armor, and then that one's the gold version of oh, it. Okay, so he leveled up. Got yeah, it. something like that, I think. If I can I, remember the story. I like this one because he looks like um, um, Pit from. Um, Kid Icarus. Yeah. <laughs> I, I like I like that oh. crown. The crown goes well with the hair. Like, yeah. And then they got the glow in the dark of this one. I don't know which character this is. I think he's one of the more bad guy, bad characters or something. I'm not too sure, but still a good guy if I can remember correctly. And it's a Barnes and Noble exclusive glow in the dark. And the Barnes and Noble that I go to downtown Brooklyn, they usually have a good amount of pops. So I'll probably be able to find it. It's this one here. Yeah. I think so at the I'm moment, I, I do need to try and get me a glow in the dark because I've got a flock, so I just need to get a, a glow, glow in the in dark, dark <laughs> For your culture. <laughs> I've got a glow in the dark. I've got a bubble head now, so. <laughs> uh, let's see. I think they're part of the Hello Kitty universe. Okay. That's Could that be. was the total, total, total Toki Dokis. Okay. Yeah, they look like they could probably, they could be part of Hello Kitty. So, okay. I'll buy that. <laughs> uh, 
I don't know what it is, but those anime pops look awesome. Yeah, they're totally dope. Right. Oh, you're talking about these, the Knights of the Zodiac. Yeah, those are cool. Funko Brothers, thank you for showing up. What's How's going on? Man? Thanks for coming. Thanks for coming through. Um, as you can see, we're going through the Funko Fair bit by bit. Thank you. <laughs> And, uh, okay, now you got the Naruto. Let me go through. Now, oh, this, this, is, this is where the fun begins, I think. Yes, for you. <laughs> for me. Like, I'm a, like, yeah, besides you, when you buy the sexy jutsu Naruto ones, eh? Yeah. <laughs> um, so. Sorry, I'm just checking if there's any new anime drops. Okay. Um, sorry, carry on. Um, oh, yeah. Pop, what's going on? Thank you for showing up. Desi um, Pop. Hey, brute. Yeah, now, so. if if you the one on the right in the orange here, right? That's the one I've been telling you about. That is the rival of of Naruto. Okay. When he's in Sage, when he first first, uh, I don't want to say transform because it's not really transform. I don't know, but he first um, <laughs> changes Leveled into up. Sage mode. <laughs> right. So that's the guy who he's fighting. Okay. In that in that in that part of the season. So I, I feel I'm, I actually have to get that one just to complete the two. Okay. You know, good guy, bad guy. Right. Then if you click back to the right, I think Which it is. is. Uh, no, no, if you click to the right. Uh, one more time. That white guy over there at the bottom there, the guy in all white, I did not know about that at all because they just recently brought one of his pops out, uh, okay. Kikeshi. So I didn't think they were green, and then they brought this out. I'm like, yeah, this is I cheap. almost fell over when I saw it. <laughs> but I, I, I want the regular one more than the chase. Well, this is the regular one. I think the chase is offering nothing, to be honest, in order for it to be a chase. Right. See, I feel it should have been, been the other way around. It's been funny with uh, just like with the um, Ochako chase that um, yeah. Funimation had. Like most people like the masked one better and feel that should have been the chase, and the unmasked one should have been the regular one. And I'm like, that's exactly it. Like, so in this case, yeah, this one seems like it should be the regular, and this one looks like it should be the chase. The reason I like the regular more is because you got the eyes, and then they actually got his yeah. his one his left eye uncovered, which it never really ever is until later in the story, right? Which is so, absolutely brilliant. I love it, and just the way it looks, he's holding that uh, baton stick or whatever you call it. I'm not too sure what the actual term for it is. Beautiful pop. So I really want to get my hands on that one. And yes, obviously the, uh, the one in the orange in in the um, in the first page. Oh, now in the first page. Yeah. Now that one, I looked at that glow in the dark Naruto. Then I saw this one in the first page. Oh, sorry. Go back. No, that's okay. <laughs> now, that middle one. That's the regular version of that. Okay. Looks so sick. If you look at the fire and the flames behind. Yeah, it, it looks cool. I'm like, I want to. I want to see how it looks in person because the picture. I'm sure. Me too, look man. Like I mean, that's exactly what I was saying. The, the picture is doing it like, whoa, that looks awesome. And then I'm like, oh, so that's the first two pops I mentioned. Those ones I definitely want to try and get. And then if I can get my hands on that Naruto, yeah, this one just looks cool. not the Glen Dog, but yeah, and really, really cool. Especially series, so you can find it just about any comic shop. They usually yeah. have, uh, get them. So I, I could and probably then, um, get that. If someone would like to buy me Naruto's dad, which is the blonde guy just below there, more than welcome to. Like, but <laughs> <This one? laughs> yeah, that's Naruto's dad. Naruto's really, really cool. <laughs> but yeah, at, if I could get gifted all of these, I'll be a happy man. But at the moment, <laughs> at the moment, um, those are the ones I want for now. You can put your address on your um, on your YouTube page, man. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, after this, after this uh, Funko Fair, I might. <laughs> no, just jokes, guys. Um, but yeah, Naruto line really cool. Yeah, um, I like how I, was, I like how a lot of these look. I just don't know the anime, so I'm like this I, one right here, I love how this. One oh, Gara, that's awesome, and it's metallic too, so that's yeah. really sick too. If I saw this, I mean, I I love my hot topic, so if I saw this, I would probably get it. I like how that looks, man. Now you see that the one to the left of it, the um, pain. That's the second version, not the second version, but uh, the glow, the glow. But the only thing I don't like about it is it's on a stand. But in order to pull oh, off that stance, he needs to be on a stand. Yeah, actually, mm -hmm. uh, Child's Collectible, boom, it's already available yeah. for pre-order. So uh, that's, um, that's called the Mighty Push stance. Okay. Yeah, really they have cool. all set up and ready to go. Dragon Ball Z, the 
Rise of Skywalker, you get the whole set of the Miles Morales, 75 bucks for all. I like, so, I like sites that do that. It makes it easier for people that's got money. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> they put it there. All five commons, pre-order, $45. That's less than $10 a pop. Like, that's what I like about Chalice Collectibles, is that they'll put up the whole set for less than what you would buy if you bought it separately. So if you're looking for deals on a set, yeah, just go go to Chalice Collectibles. You'll get all of and them. And so far, what I'm doing is these these My Hero Academia is five for fifty, but still, that's a deal. Ten bucks. That's a very that's a decent deal. Yeah. Um, excuse me. Um, oh, and so, <laughs> I missed it. Go ahead. And some now that's a good. Excuse me, sorry, man. That's that's a good deal for those five pops, in my opinion. Forty-seven bucks, like. Best off. Anyway, go back. <laughs> but um, what I'm liking so far about this fun affair, there is a good amount of decent pops that's not exclusives. Yeah, that that a was lot of them thing. are common pops, which means I'm going to be able to get them this side. Yeah, that was one thing that um they specifically mentioned that most of the pop would be commons, so you'd be able to get them anywhere. So I, mean, I appreciate you, that personally, to, to be honest. But, you know, like the AAA anime or triple A anime, I'm guessing it's called exclusives. Like, okay, mm. excuse me, the anime pops, so I get it. But, you know, they did do a lot of um, you know, common pops. Yeah. So yeah, we everybody so at the moment with stuff. a lot of a lot of these Naruto pops, they don't have the stores that in, in the European market who's actually signed up to actually sell them yet. So we have to wait and see. So I don't even know where I'm going to be able to buy them yet. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> but they're coming, they're coming. Now, I don't know if you can refresh uh, that feed on that because they announced mm-hmm. the One Piece pops. Boom. Okay. Well, I don't know if you'll be able to. Yep. There they go. They got more stuff. All right. Okay. That's we'll that's the through. latest one. So. All right. We'll click through those in a second. Let me get back to the chat real quick. Desi Pop. Yes, you've gone broke buying all these pre-orders. I haven't pre-ordered anything yet. I'm trying to see who has what, and then I'm going to figure out what I'm going to pre-order and what I'm not. And for the most I'm part, I'm sure you also you also got to be waiting for the other nine islands or eight to seven yeah, islands. Yeah, pretty much. Because <laughs> I don't I don't want to go crazy on the stuff they announced already, and then later they announce stuff I really want. So like I'm six just going to yeah. Considering that most of it is common anyway, like I'm not worried about missing out on much. Especially from what dropped already. I, I'm not worried about that. Mm-hmm. Um, oh, Batman. What's up, 007 Batman? I'm glad you showed up. Didn't know he was coming. Um, I want Naruto's all. All of them. He mis- mistyped all of them. Uh, okay. <laughs> I want all of them too, but sometimes you just got to make life choices where. You yeah, have to make <laughs> hard choices with which ones to take and which ones to leave. Um, Walgreens, Adam Wallop. The, Adam, the Walgreens by me. Um, they restocked Adam Warlock like a month ago, and I bought two of them. I gave one away in a, um, on a giveaway, and I have another one. But I do want that general grievance, and tomorrow I'm going to take a trip over to the Walgreens closest to me and see if they got one or two or three. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Lou, what's up? Glad you could show yes, up. Yes, Lou. Uh, you said you got the Miles Morales set. Yes, that deal was good. It was too good to pass up. Yeah. If I if – I, don't get too crazy. I might buy the set from Chow's Collectibles, but I know Hot Topic also has them, so I want to see if I can use my hot cash. Because if I use my hot cash, then yeah, I'm gonna go crazy. But what is it that, that for that uh, Miles Morales? How much was it? Seventy five. Yeah, for all eight, for all nine pops, was it seventy five? Not bad at no. all. Not bad at all, man. Yeah, seventy five for eight, the eight commons. So, yeah, but yeah. still, that's not bad that's at not all. Bad. That's not bad at all. But it's less than ten dollars a pop, like if I get. If I can get from um, if I can get them from Hot Top and use my hot cash, that's half price. So I'll get all mm. eight of them for like forty bucks. <laughs> so I'd much rather do that. Um, let's see. Uh, who else? Grab the Luke pin. Listen, I'm not getting that. I, we talked about that earlier. That Luke, that Hoth Luke, is the same Hoth Luke they dropped before. It's just that it has a white base instead of a black base. So they just they just double dipping on that one. I'm not buying it. <laughs> uh, guys think they'll be dropping a Demon Slayer pop before the day is over. Maybe. Um, now, Demon I'm Slayer back- is scheduled to come out. So if they drop it today, I think I might faint. 
<laughs> I don't it's know. Just, what there's just is. so much. There's so much good. Oh man! But I know people are excited for it, so we'll we'll see. <laughs> Bro, you need to get into your anime, my man. <laughs> Listen, I'm I'm just catching up on Attack on Titan. I'm up to the episode um, right before they. Right after they captured Aaron and had him chained up. I hey, listen. If, do you watch it in yeah. sub or dub? I'm watching the dubbed version. Okay, I'll watch it in, no, I watch it in dub too. So I was going to say, listen, just be careful what you say to me over chats and stuff because I'm watching it in dub, so I don't want to <laughs> get spoiled. Like, See, I, when I first started watching it years ago when it was just one season, I was watching the sub version. Yeah, but, yeah. And I same, kept saying, okay, I'm going to catch up. I'm going to catch up. But... The issue is I can't always sit there and read what's going on. Like I'm listening to the show while I'm doing other stuff and just watching when I have to to see what's going on. But something I definitely oh. noticed, and I don't know if you picked it up, the sub version is so much more emotional than the freaking dub version. Though. Yes, they're different. They're always different, and most but anime that's just, fans it's tell so you dramatic watch with the sub version. So dramatic with um, uh, Attack on Titan. Yeah. I'm I'm two episodes in on the new season, so you must let me know when you catch up so we can chat about it. Okay, yeah, I mean, um, yeah, I'm I'm just after the season where, uh, or the episode where they tried to get the girl to drink the potion to become. I don't want to say too much because I don't want to spoil it in case anybody hasn't watched it. That's but what we can chat about. Okay. Right. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, I don't know what these are. Have I don't know who they are. But the one in the blue, I like that blue, Cayenne. Uh huh. That's really cool blue. This one. And yeah, and I like the hair that it comes down around. Yeah. I actually That's like cool. how all of them look. Like they all look awesome. I just don't know what hmm. they are. She's got, like, That's not something I personally buy though, to be honest. And then she's got like almost like a diva from um, o- Overwatch. They Do they I look like they might be. They look like they might be performers or something because she has like one of those mic things. She has yeah. one of those mic things and she doesn't, but she has like headphones or something. So. I don't recognize the anime. What does it say on top there? Natsu Miku. Yeah, Hatsune Miku. So yeah. I don't know if they're, uh, um, they're like a, a, an artist, uh, an artist. They're artists, like music artists or something, but they look cool. <laughs> Definitely something I would buy, but I don't know who they are. So. Um, hold on, right before we get too far, because I know let's, let's I know not I'm let the chat get behind. No intro, no outro. No outro. <laughs> Best what? intro no. in town. How did Listen. he get on his subs, Holly? Let us know, my man. Yeah, how'd you do on your subs? Um, how do you know subs, you guys? Asking, if you like, haven't subbed to him yet, go have a look, Mister Holly English. Yes, go check him out. Um, he was having a giveaway on his last video. I don't know if he did the giveaway yet. If he did, let us know. If you didn't. Um, yeah, guys, go to his latest video, follow his instructions, and enter the giveaway. Yeah, man. Mr. Otherwise, Holly. if you're not subbed, go in sub, bro. Yeah, go sub. Damn it. <laughs> damn, damn it. Um, here we now, go. One piece. Now, don't, don't, click don't, don't click too quickly. Don't click too quickly, bro. So <laughs> on, on Instagram. Tell me who these people are. They announced this, right? They put it there. Uh-huh. And I saw now this is all the ones that they said they're going to bring out. Uh-huh. And I noticed just underneath there was a second page for this. And I was like, don't do this to me. Because <laughs> as it stands, uh-huh. I really want four of the pops on the screen at the moment. Okay. And this is why I constantly said to you in our chats that I need to find money. <laughs> Okay, so obviously um, on the bottom on the bottom left, that's Luffy in a um, this one. What do you call it? Kimono. Uh, kimono yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. Then you got uh, the one just on his top, uh, Sobo. It's his brother. He's okay. like, uh, like adopted, like uh, orphaned brother. Like he yeah. was raised with him. If you understand okay. what I mean? He's both are cool. I would, I would definitely they look really. Su- I'm so glad they made it. I want it. <laughs> Oh, man. And then the guy next to him on the right is Crocodile. He's one of the seven warlords and one of Luffy's first major fights. Like, okay. big time. Really awesome. I love this pop. It's amazing. Look at the claw. <laughs> Look at the little uh, tornado in his right hand. Yeah, I was wondering what that was. Bro. That's a tornado. And so that cigar. I hope. Uh, sand. He's got okay. the ability to control sand. Okay. 
and um, the cigar. I hope it's not just painted on and it actually is sticking out. It makes it even sweeter. Yeah, I've never seen them actually do like a painted on um, thing like I that. Don't, so probably I, it probably cigar. is, isn't it? Yeah. But not an actual cigar, but you know what I mean. It's yeah, probably, yeah. yeah, definitely something sticking out. And then you got uh, Luffy's right hand man. This one. Yeah. Zorro. I like this one because the sword so, in his mouth. Like, come yeah, on. he's 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 a three he's a he's a three three style sword fighter or something. So that's that's him, just in the kimono, and uh -huh. in ba in fight stance, I suppose. And yes, I want to get that one too. Looks really sick. Yeah. Now, oh my God. What about? I know this? I said this a lot today, and um, I almost cried when I saw the next page. So if you click okay. to the right. Oh, I like this one. <laughs> <laughs> yes. This now, one. the one on the left, I don't know what that's going to be. Um, I don't know topic. if they're just mentioning that Luffy is going to be a Hot Topic exclusive. Yeah, because it looks, it looks the exactly same. the same. They're not saying anything, so maybe they're just mentioning there's a Hot Topic exclusive. Yeah. Now, the one on the right. Okay. Right Now, Luffy's ability, he, mm -hmm. he calls it gears. So he can go into gear one, gear two, well, gear two technique. Gear one is normal. Okay. Gear two he does something with his blood cells. Gear okay. three, he changes the size of his body parts. Gear okay. four, Ooh. he's bounce man. But this is snake man, if I'm not sick. So it's just, it's complicated. But, bro. <laughs> Sounds good. If it's metallic, I'm going to pick up one. <laughs> Listen, I don't that Luffy, care. fourth gear. I'll, I'll get it. I'm going to be sad if that's not six inch. It doesn't look like it is because they're not saying it is. Okay. But well, if that was six inch, it'll make it even sweeter. Right, well, it says it's Chalice Collectible exclusive, so let me uh, refresh the Chalice Collectibles page to see if they. Oh, there it is. Okay, so it's twenty dollars. So it's not a six inch fourth gear, fourth gear yeah. Luffy. Okay, so they're All not right. saying because there's there's two there's two fourth gears. Um, I know it sounds weird. You got Snake Man, which I believe is this one possibly by the mm -hmm. looks of it, and you got um, Bounce Man. I think it's translated in English from the Japanese, where okay. he Literally bounces everywhere. But man, okay, so it's a regular pop. It's not a. Yep, they got them all. Oh, man. There you go. Set of five. Look at that. Alice. There you go. <laughs> but yes, as you know, big One Piece fan, and that is absolutely amazing. Yeah, it does look cool. I mean, I'm not a fan. I don't know what any of them are, but they do look pretty freaking awesome. No. If Definitely you have a look at the Zoro pop, wow. if you look at the Zoro pop, like look at his clothes, his 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 body is come out. It's like flapping in the wind. How oh, sick mm -hmm. is that design? Yeah. That's and awesome. if you have a look at uh, Luffy, he's still got the straw hat on his back. I don't know if you can see it just in the corner, in between his under his right arm, there? you can see it sticking. Yeah. Out. Yeah. Bro, these pops are sweet, man. And if this one is metallic, oh, I'm definitely grabbing it. I'm gonna grab one. <laughs> Yeah, 33 subs. Oh, come on. We can get Mr. Holly English up to – come on. Come on now. 33. Minimum. Minimum 50, guys. Come on. Tell your come friends. On. Tell your friends to tell their friends. And you know most of us have two or three YouTube accounts. Get up there. Get <laughs> up there. Seem to get a lot of good anime exclusive. Hope they're reliable. I don't know. Um, I you use, you use Chalice, Chalice, isn't it? Collectibles many times, and I, I have not had an issue with them yet. And, excuse me, they actually ship certain pops, depending on how many you order, in their own box, a Chalice Collectibles box. As a matter of fact, you go back and look at some of my Chalice Collectible videos, you'll see. Yes, yeah, I Chalice think you were confused on the one video why they put in a separate box, and then you realized. Yeah. So they have their own box, um, and i order my pop protectors from Chalice Collectibles. So um, as far as my experience, I have not had a problem with them. So if you do buy from them, I don't suspect that you have much of an issue. You see, now the thing about this is the, this is all the One Piece pops. I almost want all of them. I mean, even that skeleton filler, uh, Brooke, I would still I would still get him anyway, but like it's not a priority though. Cool. It looks cool, but it's not cool. priority though. Like I would rather, if I, if I had to choose, I'd, I'd choose him last. As opposed to the other ones, you know. Right. Um, now, the thing that's intriguing, besides Demon Slayer, which is rumored to be announced, there's still uh, My Hero Academia. Yeah. So we don't know what they're bringing out. There hasn't been any spoilers on what they're bringing out. So right. that's going to be almost all surprise. 
and uh, so, Baku, 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 what's this called again? Bakugan. Bakugan. That's the little ball things where they throw into the little thing and it transforms yeah. into these uh, Yeah, I never watched the beasts. actual anime or cartoon, whichever one it was. I'm assuming it's an anime since they're dropping it with anime. But my mm. son used to like the toys. So I used to buy him the little Bakugans and mm. they had ones that formed into bigger ones. I'm surprised this thing is still a thing. I, like, I figured it would have died out by now. Mm. <laughs> and when I heard they were doing pops for it, I'm like, really? Like, my son was like nine ten years old when <laughs> this was popular. That's, that's a good few years ago isn't it but no yeah it was about 12 years ago <laughs> 12 years ago yeah so now if you click to the right what i like is you may you may like it as well yeah i saw this this looks really cool can you imagine that's in metallic that that uh egyptian yeah, looking one probably that is. would look sick in metallic it looks bro. like it it should be it definitely looks like it should be and actually um i saw it at target I was on the Target site. Where did it go? Hold on. Let me refresh. Because I was on here earlier and I saw it. And I was like, I didn't see this announced. I don't know what this is. Oh, where are you? Yeah, it'll right. be done here uh, somewhere now. Yeah, now it's going to be lost in the sauce. <laughs> well, it's two of three. So it's... Okay, there, yeah, here we go. Should be here because I see. There we go. Right. No, yeah, it says it nothing really about show if it's metallic or not, but oh, that should be like if that's not metallic, they really lost the plot. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it doesn't say if it's metallic or not, and there's nothing really in the um information page about page, <laughs> it doesn't say anything, so yeah, yeah, I don't know, but definitely looks like it should be metallic. And I recognize this kid because I remember watching, not watching it, but seeing like the advertisements for the cartoon and stuff, the anime, sorry. And he looks familiar. So mm. I'm like, all right, cool. Um, I'm not a fan of him, but again, pops that look pretty cool. So this guy <laughs> looks familiar. This guy looks familiar. So yeah, something that uh, if you're a Bakugu, Bakugan, I said Bakugu. If you're a Bakugan fan, <laughs> then yeah, these would definitely be for you. Let's see. That's it. That's it so far. That's it so far. Like, I don't know. What what time is it there by you now, bro? It's um, here it's uh, 5 o'clock. 5 o'clock. 52. 6 o'clock. It seems like they've been announcing like every, every hour. hour. So, so we can right, still go. We'll, we'll ride it out for eight minutes, man. We ain't going nowhere yet. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm just saying they can, they can um, still go, like, isn't it? Yeah, we'll check. They can out. still, but um, yeah. Chase Chase says the um, so far all might soda. Yeah, that's the has only the, uh, my hero has, that I've seen. Has the has the Deku has the Deku pop uh, uh, soda been released already? Has, yeah, they have it? the Deku soda. Yeah, yeah, yeah um, that came out a while ago. Um, it's already there. It is right there. Yeah, that's been out for yeah. a while. I like the glow though. The glow looks sweet. Yeah. If I if I got this, I would definitely want the glow. Like if I didn't get the glow, I'd like it because you know I like that glow. I like my hero, but this is definitely one to get. <laughs> it says pre-order, but it's been on their site for a while. So because it's been announced for a while, it's a twenty thousand piece. So we'll see. Um, where's the All Might? This is a twenty thousand piece. Beetle juice is fifteen thousand. Oh, I gotta grab one. <laughs> but it's a but the chase looks sick though. Yeah, I like the chase on this one too. Where he was uh gonna get married to Lydia at the end. I like he even had the the ring on his finger. I like that. See, I like when they do chases that are that that's meaningful that to the story. Yeah, it makes sense why it's a chase. It's not just like this. Well, yeah, it's just glow in the dark, so it's not really that. But you can't really that. make a story chase like. Like well, with this, this with this, you could you could actually make it his weakened state or something, maybe like you could have, because just like they did Superman and his chase was Bizarro, so it makes sense. Okay, his opposite or his chase would be Bizarro, like something like this, where this is the regular and this is the chase. It's like okay, he's just holding a bag of chips. Like, I mean, it is glow in the dark too, but it's like eh, okay. This could you <laughs> see them? Could you see them selling? sodas that's like big groups of sodas right like uh they say a ninja turtle soda right 
you got the four Ninja Turtles, yeah. then you got Splinter, and then you got April O'Neil. Oh, like a six pack? As, that's exactly where I was going. Yes. Yes. As a six pack. Can you imagine them selling that in a six pack? How sick that would, would that be? Awesome. The four turtles. I wouldn't open them. I'll just keep it in a six April pack. And Splinter. Hell <laughs> just yeah. for the oh, concept. Actually, it would be the four turtles. Um, Shredder, because they have a Shredder, and I don't think they did an April or Splinter, but I think they, they April did one is the yeah, yeah, but I mean, I'm just saying that's just the first thing I could think of with the amount yes. of. And since they have the the um, Lucha they Libre, they could do those as six yeah. packs. Well, <laughs> yes, I get it. Oh, I'm just looking oh, at that. Um, Rebop and Rocksteady. There you go for the turtles. I think so the Rocksteady, um, the Rocksteady Chase looks silly though. What this one? Yeah. I don't know. The, yeah. Looks yeah, yeah, man. But yeah, like um, with this funk affair, like to be honest, I was down, mm-hmm. as you know, and then I was up again with the with the mankind thing, uh-huh. and then I was kind of down again because they weren't doing a video, uh-huh. and then I was up again with the amount of pops that they're releasing for each um, anime line. So yeah. like it's it's an up and down thing. I just as I was saying to you before the, before we went live, I just we or I don't even know if I mentioned it in the live. I just wish they communicated just a little bit more, you know, and just said, yeah. this is what we're doing. This is how we're doing it. Because I, for one, was assuming that there's going to be a video for each line. All right, Desi, thanks for showing up. Good night, Desi. If you guys haven't subbed to Desi, go go sub to his channel. I think go he's great, isn't he? Stormcore Pops, what's up? Thank you. Now Stormcore. Appreciate it. Um, so, yeah, I don't know if they could just be just a little bit more. You know, just, you know, that... It, it helps uh, lower and higher expectations, I think, in my opinion. Yeah. I mean, I, I, I'm with you because I was kind of feeling the same way. I was like, ah, okay, they they did some stuff, and I'm not too excited. But then you know, this uh, peak got me hype, and then I saw what they were dropping today. I'm like, all right, I'm liking mm-hmm. this stuff. And this, is the, this isn't even the stuff I'm as interested in, like the anime stuff. I'm like, okay, fine. So imagine you're feeling it because it's good looking I pops. really care about you know? Oh my goodness. They but like, you some know, of the, the wrestling leaks, it's, it's like, okay, I'm, I'm hype. I'm, I'm ready. Like getting I'm ready. there, yeah. You see, the thing is, like, I even said to the kids, you kids are not watching TV at three o'clock. <laughs> I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to play, I'm going to play it on my TV. Yeah. I'm going to sit down and watch it. I'm going to get excited, almost faint on the floor. And then there was nothing. And then, yeah. as I said to you, wait till four o'clock. Maybe the pops will be stabbed at four o'clock. Then right. they just drop the pictures, and I'm like, why? And then That's... they drop it. They drop it with the least interesting anime, because there's five hundred of them. Dragon Ball Z. I was like, oh man, please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but we'll see. I mean, like like we said, there's there's still time for them to drop some uh some more of the anime stuff, and um. We're gonna wait for another three minutes and then refresh the feed and see what's going on. Um, but I know what you at said, Soda, not Sophia. I got it. <laughs> but look, um, at the same time, I do understand that they can't do a video, especially if they're releasing so many pops in one line. Yeah, I mean, it, I can understand they can't really make a small video on it because it's just too many pops to feature, and I can understand that. Like, but yeah, I get it. Head, but it's heads like up would have been nice. It, they they started the sneak peek with this video, and then they show this this fair and say, yeah, every day we're gonna announce a different thing. You're expecting video because they started with video. So I'd I can say understand if, why you're upset because I thought the same thing. I thought they were gonna do video. I'd me. say if they had to do a sneak peek, to be honest, like I feel what they could have done is maybe a do a sneak peek and have a little bit of every island. Yeah. Rick, you know, yeah. and say this is what we're showing you now, but there's going to be more. I would have right. been off my thing, you yeah, know. And they said crazy, right? <laughs> every hour we would drop the pictures, and I'll be like, bro, I'll be on my Instagram waiting for every hour. You know what I mean? Yeah, it would have been crazy. But um, what do you say? Um, yeah, you know, like Stormcore pops. Uh, this one, like this, could have been the common. But the chase should have been him without his armor, not just without the helmet. Because, like, remember when he got the full gauntlet? Oh, not even a full gauntlet. But so the chase, the chase is without the helmet. Yeah. So the you say the chase? Helmet. You feel the chase should be with helmet? No, it should have been without his armor at all. As well. remember so. in remember in um 
Infinity War, after he yeah. got the second um, stone, he took off all his armor. So he was just walking around without armor. Yeah, because he, did, he didn't need it because he was right. earlier, earlier than now at the time. Right. Now, I understand, of course, you're going to want all the gems in the gauntlet because you can't like do without the gems. You want the gems. But the chase should have just been without the armor, not but just I see, without the helmet. I see what Stormcore is saying, though. He's saying, personally, he lo- it looks like a common to him. It's like you got the, the regular one that looks so amped up with yeah. the full armor, and then you just take the helmet off for the chase. Poor, poor decision in my opinion as well. Yeah, this is one of the those chase decisions where it's like all they did was take off the helmet. Yeah, he's smiling, but still, it's 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 not different enough to make me go, okay, it's cool. It's like, eh, whatever. You see, this this is what I was saying all afternoon to my to my wife is the fact that they need to get. It's like at the moment, it just for me, it seems that a lot of these things they don't they don't really have anyone that's interested in the genre. It's just someone that knows a little bit about it and doesn't appreciate right. it like the true fans right something to make to make the chases actually feel like chases like something special because like this yeah. one they changed it to black and it's metallic okay it's enough of a change to go okay i i like that you know that is that's not a bad that's not a bad idea at all right so that's cool and then also with the um, iron man you know of course you make the chase metallic he's iron man <laughs> so I get why the chase is metallic. It's the same pop, but it's metallic. So I get it. It's a chase that makes sense. It's not really different, but you know, it makes sense for it to be metal. But then you have this one, which the chase seems like is metallic, but why? He's Spider-Man. <laughs> why is the chase just metallic? They didn't even change the symbol like they did with Venom to a different color. It's just metallic Spider-Man. Yeah, but listen, you also got to realize like what else could they have made it without making? Because you already you already got it that it's like a Luchador style. If you change it too much, you either lose the Luchador style or you lose the Spider-Man style. Right. But what they could have did if they were going to make it metallic, they should have made it the Iron Spider colors. Because remember, he had the Iron Spider suit. That's also true. Listen, man. <laughs> That That's why you're the more, brains of the operation. Bro. The brains of the operation. <laughs> like with Sonic, they have regular Sonic, and it's flocked. Okay, it's enough of a change. I get it. That's decent Even though enough, yeah. I don't really care for the for the um, colors of Rocksteady, I get it. They they you know because they did Shredder in like this brightly colored scheme also for this chase. So okay, I, I get think it. I think Chase Kingdom is just yeah. busy saying that he's saying that's the dark light or the black light. Sorry. Yeah, the black light. Right. Yeah. Yeah, like Shredder being Blacklight. Right, exactly. So that's the same thing they did with um with um Rocksteady, I believe. Yeah. Blacklight. Uh, that's so, why it looks okay, so, that's fine. why it looks so silly, yeah. I see right. now. Um, um but then Stormcore's comment they're saying uh, should have been the gardening Thanos. I can agree with that to a certain Yeah. Point. Even that that, that could actually be Thanos because that's change. as you were talking about earlier, that's touching on another moment in the movie. Right. They could have did this one as the regular, even without the helmet as the regular, whichever one doesn't matter, and then do gardening Thanos as the chase. He still had on the gauntlet, it still had the, the stones in it, just a different outfit. He gardened it. He had it on his t shirt and his pants. Okay, fine. I get it. <laughs> That's what I'm saying with certain chases. Like they they I don't even know if they really put thought into it. It's like, all right, we're just gonna do this. Cause like Pale Man. I never saw Pan's Labyrinth. Well, I won't say I never saw it. I saw parts of it. I heard it's a good movie. I never really watched it straight through. But this makes sense because everybody's seen the at least the preview, the trailer, where he puts his hands up and his eyes are in it. It makes sense. I get it. And also, that moment where you actually see him in the garden, um, it's actually... The monumental moment in the story when the Avengers actually go there and Thor does that that thing we um executes him. Yeah, right. That is like a profound moment in the movie. That's like bro. Right. <laughs> you know? Some of some of that makes sense. Cause even Harley, I love Harley. You guys watch what, my what is Harley's what is Harley's um But the difference is she's got a hammer instead of her bat and the chase is metallic. And it's like I think they could have gone further. They could have done new school and old school, in my opinion. Yeah, exactly. That's unless unless this they're planning on bringing out. 
and you could have did old school Harley with the hammer. That the only reason cheap. I could say that they didn't do that is because they're going to bring out the old school Harley soda too. They probably will, but the thing with Harley is that she's got so many different looks. You could have got away with it. You could have did this one as the regular. You could actually done. You could have. You're right. Chase. And still because you brought out more Harley. You as a fan would have bought both of them regardless, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> and when you have when you have a character that has so many different looks, it's easy to pull off um, different sodas. Even if you're gonna, like you said, they're probably gonna do an old school Harley. But then what's going to be her chase? Is it going to be the same thing? Old school Harley with a, a hammer and then the chase is going to be metallic with a bat. Like you could have did old school Harley with the hammer as the chase. And then you still had the Arthur Burns of Harley. The, in, go ahead. In, in hindsight, in what you're saying there, that would make sense anyway. Because if they did a new school Harley with the old weapon, uh, then you do the old school Harley with the new and the old new weapon. weapon. Right, exactly. So it's it. not a bad idea in essence. Right. The Flock Sonic, yes, I want that Flock Sonic too. That's what I'm saying. Like the new soda. If it's, if it's flocked right, it's a damn good pop. <laughs> Honestly. Uh, Dr. Green Thumb, what's going on? I'm glad you could show How's up. it, bro? That's actually my brother in law. How are you doing, okay, bro? Cool, cool. So you, you can downstairs. order your own pop online now. They didn't put it online yet. Did they? Did you not see in the sneak peek, my bro? Yeah, they did. I did saw it. it at the end of the video. They said they they didn't say a date, but they said this year you can order your own custom pop and make it online. Wow. Okay. Did you not I'm see that, that though? I saw we, were, we actually dodged I, all of that. <laughs> I saw when they, when they went to that part. They were talking about it in the sh in um at their the store. Skit, yes. And then they showed the guy at the pop on the bench, but I didn't hear them say you could do it online. They okay. actually mentioned it, yeah. You'll be okay. able to do it okay. online this year, they said, I think. Cool. Well, that's something that we assumed they were going to get to anyway. So it's not but like... Now the, the fact that they've like, announced it. Yeah, they so announced cool. it, so that's great. That's excellent. I'm so happy that they did that. <laughs> so happy that they did that. Um, I think so a lot yeah. of people are going to be, yeah. The so, question yeah, is just what is the price going to be? Yeah. I mean, I think it was twenty five bucks in store, so I can't imagine them going too much higher than that. I can't um, imagine them changing the price at all. Yeah, because and now they're actually going to have time to do it. So, what is the, what? What would be the difference? Yeah, yeah. You know, so, if you're in store, you've got someone waiting for the pop. If you order it online, you can right. make it with your time and then send it. Right. You got like two, three weeks, <laughs> months in some cases before you're probably going to get it anyway. Like. Something will be cool, which would be a cool feature, but possibly not a lot of people like it because of their branding and that sort of thing. But how cool would it be is if you have your own pop and you got your hoodie and you can put your logo on your hoodie? Oh, that would be cool. That would <laughs> to be, be able to put my own sick. logo on my pop. What? Oh, speaking of logos, bam, I got stickers, guys. <laughs> Look yeah, at that segue buddy. right there, bro. I got stickers. I mean, it's just my logo, JKL. Awesome. Oh, I just that, stickers, that's a really but... cool logo. It's perfectly round too. That's that's just yeah. That just makes um, a class right there. They were these were actually done by uh, Funko Bros Pops, not to be confused with the Funko Brothers. Um, right now, on Instagram, I believe he's uh, going by Senpai, but it's still Funko Bros underscore Pops. Um, they had put an ad out on their um, page about it, and then he had messaged me, um, DM'd me on uh, Instagram, and I was like, "All right, well, you know, I'll check. I'll I'll check in the new year because this was last year. I was like, wait for New Year's to go through. I'll hit you up. We'll see." I finally hit him up, and then he said, "Uh, yeah, I got you." So he made me some. They were actually very well priced. Um, I got. A crap load of them. So now, so. now that you finally got your own <laughs> sticker, I think I must actually send you over my sticker. <laughs> so, so now you actually got them. So now we can, um, we can yeah. trade. Yeah, trade some stickers. Um, yeah, guys, I'm gonna be sending up some out to some people, and I'm gonna have to order some more. They're definitely gonna be um, getting out there. So, all those who are asking when I was gonna get stickers, I finally got some finally got some <laughs> and actually i might have uh i'm not even supposed to say this but i might have some phone cases coming so <laughs> well, we, li 
Wheeling and dealing. Wheeling and this. dealing. Wheeling and dealing. I might have some phone cases coming. It all depends on, uh, on K. So K awesome, get on that. You need some JKL awesome phone cases. <laughs> She's on top of that. That's right. Get to it. Um, I'm refreshing the Funko feed now. I don't think there's anything more for today, I don't think. Right now. So if they do drop something more. So there was oh, an no, hour ago. Actually, it says it's over. Yeah. Here. They did the post. It says reveals are over for day two. So, so that's all. Yeah, so no yeah. Demon Slayer, no My Hero Academia. No, that's yeah. really weird. So the My Hero Academia, they must have just meant the soda. Yeah, that's pretty um, pretty disappointing. <laughs> see now, no, you see now. Now they got now they got us on a low end again. Yeah. Now with tomorrow, they're gonna have us on a bloody high end again, depending on what they. Oh man. Well, tomorrow is supposed. To, what's tomorrow? Sports. What is that? I can't see. It. Tomorrow, yeah, sports and games. Um, of course, in the picture it says video games, but down here it just says games. So I'm assuming all types of games, but we'll so see. Sports and games. So um, the sports ones, I don't usually care for. Um, what are you I, expecting I, to see in the in this category, though? I mean, as far as sports, I know they were coming out with a, with some more of the classic um, NBA and football players. Baseball so, as well, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, they'll probably do some baseball ones too. I didn't hear about baseball ones, but I'm sure they will. I think um, our friend Fabian said something about uh, baseball, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. Um, but as far as games, I mean, like I said, here it says video games, but of course here it just says games. So games in general, I don't know. I, I'm assuming they're going to announce the Colonel Mustard Pop that goes with the clue. With the retro toys. Which you're hoping five. for, isn't it? Because you've got the yeah. others. Because I got all five, the first five. So I definitely want Colonel Mustard. So I'm hoping. Go watch the video. Yeah. Hashtag <laughs> hey, JKL's videos. Go have a look. Yes, go watch the Clue video. It was very, uh, it was fun for me to do that video. Um, so I'm hoping they announce that. Um, like I said, I'm assuming it's going to be an exclusive with a store. That's the only reason why they didn't drop it. But one of them is already a Hot Topic exclusive, and they dropped that one. So I don't know why they wouldn't drop Colonel Mustard unless there's something special about it. Um, and actually, they might drop another character because they may – I didn't know this, but in researching for my video, I saw that they did a, a new Clue character. They had taken out Mrs. White and added um, – I don't remember the name of the character, but it was a different color. She was pink, I think. <laughs> it wasn't Mrs. Pink. It was uh, – I don't remember what they called her. Anyway, now, the why matter. why would they take Mrs. White out if she's part of the man? Is it changed in the actual game as well, or? Yeah, yeah, oh, okay. um, yeah. They they changed. They took out the game piece for Mrs. White, which was a white piece, and they brought in this pink piece. I forgot what they called it though, but still. And I was hmm. like, why? I mean, because it's Mrs. White. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, is it's very a reason? I don't know. Um, it's strange whatever. though. Um, what is the original like, game? Yeah, it's not like there's not people out there named who, whose last name is White. So, it, it, <laughs> I yeah, don't know. I'm um, only I thing know. I could assume is it's a race thing, and they took it out because of the, that. The, the sensitivity of the nations exactly. is getting ridiculous. I don't get it, but if they might drop those clue pops, um, I'm excited for you. I hope they drop them, Mister Mustard. Um, other games I could see them doing. Um, I know a lot of people were looking for The Last of Us. Um, oh. I never played the game, but I know it was a very popular Bro. game. The um, Last of Us, yeah, I'm keen for this. If they did Among Us pops, most of us are. It like, could be. I mean, yeah. I've only played it a, a little bit when my kids were here. I finally played it, and we had fun. It, it is a fun game. I really didn't know what I was doing most of the time, but it was fun. <laughs> so. If they drop some Among Us pops, I would definitely be excited to get at least one, a red one. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to think of what other popular games. Some um, some Grand Theft Auto Pokemon. Pop awesome. Pokemon. Um, definitely, they're gonna do some Pokemon pops. I'm now pretty sure I'm intrigued now because I just realized now they're releasing ones that they said they're gonna release plus more. Mm -hmm. So what are we in store for Pokemon? Um, that's gonna be grand. 
I don't know. I mean, you saw the the Ponyta, the Pikachu, the then this, Raichu. Um, then this Meowth. Meowth. Um, I would think they would do like Meowth, Wobbuffet, because that was a pretty popular one. Uh, Psyduck like, is the other one. Psyduck and a, a Ditto. Those would be my guess for ones that are coming next. How would the Ditto look there? It looked like a blob because they don't no, but I mean, anything. <laughs> so yeah. it like the blob. That's really cool. That the blob. Uh, thank you for everyone who's uh, talking about my stickers. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Um, yeah. Trust me. I'm going to start getting them out to people. I only, I don't, I have, I said I have a bunch, but it's really not that much. It's about 20 of them. So everyone can't get one right now, but. They will be circulating, and I'm going to order some more. Um, he did a really good job on these, so I'm definitely going to order some more, and they'll they'll be out there. So, um, Yeah, there's new Pokemon coming. Yes, Psyduck, Snorlax. See, Snorlax needs to be a six-inch at least. <laughs> six-inch or more. <laughs> like, um, they've pretty much done 10 inches of almost all of them that have come out so far. And it wouldn't surprise me if they continue to do 10 inches of all of them. But Snorlax, at the very least, needs to be 6 inch. I don't want to see a 4 inch Snorlax. It doesn't six make inch. sense. Yeah, no. 6 inch. But I'm not sure they're going to do a Snorlax yet. In regards to, you mentioned now just before I jumped on the Pokemon bagwagon, GTA Pops. What, what, what Pops do you think? Do you think they'll bring San Andreas Pops out? I would be keen on that. Um, the thing is, like, I, I'm, I was never a huge Grand Theft Auto fan. But the characters are popular, so it wouldn't surprise me if they did like some San Andreas or what was the other one? Um, Vice City. Vice City, yeah. It wouldn't surprise it me. Looks, if they did the main yeah. characters of each game, it wouldn't be bad. Each, I mean, the three characters of the latest one isn't a bad idea either. Yeah, I mean, characters from any of them, really, because they were popular games and people um, would know the characters. Like, I personally wouldn't know. I would know the looks of them because I I've seen them, so I know what some of them look like. I couldn't tell you their names or what part of the game they play, but yeah, I, I would be like, okay, those are cool. I, I get it. I know it's Grand Theft Auto. I know those characters, so okay, I get it. <laughs> what would be really funny is if they did the hot chocolate pop. <laughs> that was the uh, that was the 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 part of the game where you can go get some fun time with the ladies of the night if you get my meaning. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 I see, I see, I see. <laughs> that was funny. So yeah, if they did those, that would be pretty cool. But yeah, uh, as far as games, yeah, uh, I can't really think of much else. I can't think of, I can't see them bringing more Overwatch pops out. Um, they, they they probably will. I don't know if it's going to be part of the fair, but they probably will. I mean, they said they have over 300. So, uh, yeah, I, I could see them doing a couple more Overwatch. I mean, it's still a pretty popular game, so. Yeah, I think uh, so. And, you know, we both think they might do some more Fortnite, which I don't think they should, but they might. Uh. <laughs> but Among Us, I think maybe the Among Us would be the, one of the big ones to come out, I think. Yeah, if they did it's Among Us. Like, it's a perfect time to do it, I think. Yes, and it's it's still a, a popular game. It's still, you know, um, relevant. So yeah, doing some Among Us pops, I think that would be the big um, reveal, or one of the big reveals for tomorrow mm -hmm. if they're doing it. So, anybody out there got some guesses what they're gonna do tomorrow? <laughs> he says to maybe Warcraft. You. Oh, maybe, possibly. Warcraft's big at the moment. Like, there's a lot of people talking about the Warcraft pops at the moment. So. Perhaps. Yeah, I was never uh, big on Warcraft. I never played it. Um, people told me it's my type of game, but I never, uh, you know, so we'll see. <laughs> you said I expect Overwatch. Yeah. yeah two maybe. drops. Makes sense, yeah. Maybe. Oh, you know, they could also bring retro game pops out as well. Yeah, yeah. I mean, they it literally they could be anything at this point because I don't remember seeing any spoilers for like game pops to come out. Right. And so. they they have their retro line out now. I mean, the clue and all that stuff. So, um, yeah, unfortunately, it's very unlikely we're going to see any Nintendo related uh, Funko Pops because Nintendo has been denying them that license forever. Nintendo is very protective over their license. 
see the thing with Pokemon is that um, Funko can do Pokemon pops because Nintendo doesn't own Pokemon. They have the license to make the games, but they don't own Pokemon. They don't own Pokemon itself. But yeah. as far as Nintendo, like doing Mario, yeah, it's, you're not going to see any Mario Funko pops. I would love to see them, but I doubt it. He said, "From Blizzard Point, if of you give me Diablo, another game I'm I never played, but I'm familiar with, and yeah, definitely. that would probably that would probably be a big one too. That would definitely, definitely. be a big one. That would be really sick, I think, Diablo. Yeah, if they did. Um, I'm trying to think of old old retro games. Like if they did, like I know they already did Space Invaders, um, which I'm mad I never got, but." <laughs> If they did some more of the old school, um, I know they did Pac-Man already. I missed those too. But if they did like the eight-bit Pac-Man, because the Pac-Man pops they did were more like the cartoon, cartoony version. Yeah, the new one. If they did the eight-bit version, that'd be yeah. pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah, those would be pretty cool. Eight-bit Pac-Man, Mrs. Pac-Man, Baby Pac-Man with all the ghosts. That would be pretty cool. I would like to see those. <laughs> that would be cool. Yeah. Yeah, they did a lot of the Halo pops that have been dropping lately. The only one I really want is the um, the Invisible Master Chief, the Cloak Master Chief. All the rest of them I don't really care for. Um, I have an old Master Chief with Cortana. Um, where is he? Oh, he's on the other side. Um, <laughs> I just got a new shelf, so I got more pops on that side now. <laughs> I didn't do any um, any rearranging videos because in the past month I've rearranged my pops like three times already, which is why you see my background's been changing. I don't know if you guys have noticed. <laughs> but yeah. Um y'all remember Dizzy. What's Dizzy? Who's Dizzy? Not familiar. Y'all y'all would have to um you'd have to tell me what that is. Uh got pics of that one on my Insta. Pics of which one? Oh Halo? Yeah, some of the Halo Pops are pretty cool. Uh, so many egg variants they can make. Not sure what you're talking about, uh, Dizzy, with egg variants. Not something I'm familiar with. Uh, oh, that's... listen. Just realizing now. Angry Birds. That's a game. Oh, yeah. And there were, there was talks about Angry Bird Pops recently, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. 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 Angry Birds. Bet on it. Don't bet on it. But... Don't Most be. likely. <laughs> <laughs> Angry Birds, yes. Angry Birds. He just said egg now, and that made me think of it. Yeah, okay. That I could see that happening. Some Angry Birds pops. So, yeah. As far as the Funko Fair... Um, How like long is said, this? This is hitting until... It's nine days, so that's until when? Um, Next Tuesday. Know. They got seven After. more days to go, yeah. So probably Monday, uh, Monday or Tuesday next week, it'll be mm. over. But um, yeah, guys, uh, just about everywhere, all um, the pops are available. Like they've been announcing them, and the stores have been dropping them. So you can go to Amazon, you can go to um, Walmart, go to Target, go to um, Hot Topic. Chalice Collectibles. Chalice Everybody Collectibles, if you want your bundles, isn't it? Yeah. Chalice, does the yeah, bundles. Chalice Collectibles does a lot of cool bundles, so yeah. <laughs> um, if you want those One Piece Pops, uh, that Chalice Collectibles exclusive Luffy fourth gear, um, the Naruto Pain Glow in the Dark, they got those. Um, they're not Chalice Collectibles, not sponsored, by the way, so you know, I know you <laughs> hear me talk about them a lot, but Chalice Collectibles. Ever had a go, problem? I'm gonna go check them out. Yeah, I haven't ever had a problem with that company, and I I really like them. Um, they're one of those sites that I came across, and I I when I order stuff from them, I never have issues. So that's why I talk about them. Um, yeah, so hit them up if you're interested in some of those bundles. I haven't bought a bundle from them yet, but I might. <laughs> so you, you might know. <laughs> I still don't know what that means. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, you're losing me. I have no idea what Dizzy is. Dizzy was on the spectrum. Yeah, I'm still lost. You might have to hit me on Instagram or my DM and explain. 
but yeah um so guys um i think that's about it for today unless you got anything more you want to say with i'm cool for now cool okay I'm cool. um what, what have you got, got coming up down in the chats um you didn't you know hit us up but um i want to say thank you and appreciate the fact that i hit 400 subs uh everybody who hit me on the dms who hit my posts um congratulating me and thanking me um i want to thank you guys because that was awesome to actually hit 400 <laughs> um i really didn't um expect to hit 400 that fast like i went from 200 to 400 quick <laughs> very quick and um I just appreciate like people coming through and uh, promoting my channel. I've had so many channels just like randomly shout me out, and it was like uh, some channels that I didn't even know they knew who I was. Like, okay, thanks, I appreciate it. It's it's just been awesome. And as usual, you know, I try to hit everybody's channel that I can. I shout people out randomly. Like, yeah, uh, I'm I'm all about trying to spread the love for everybody. So thank you guys um, for showing some love back. Um, yeah. Also, yeah. Check my check my videos. Usually, I drop Amazon links. I'm an Amazon affiliate. I, I say it all the time. So, I usually drop Amazon links in my videos for uh, pops that I have in the videos. So, yeah, check them out. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I hope it's gonna be a good year. I'm trying to get to to a thousand subs this year. No, what did I say? Two thousand subs this year. Two thousand subs. This year. <laughs> so hopefully, I can get two thousand. If I go from 400 today to 2,000 by December, I would be ecstatic. So thanks for um, supporting um, Funko PDX. Have a good night. Thank you for showing up. My Appreciate brother, it. Good night. Thanks for popping in. Um, as far as what I have coming up tomorrow, I have a What's in the Box challenge. Um, I dropped a video yesterday. Did I? Yeah. Um, Mr. Techbot sent me a pop, so I dropped that video yesterday. I, I got a What's in the Box challenge with uh, K that should be out tomorrow. If I finish editing it and um, I have other stuff coming, like I said, I'm working on my Patreon. Um, I got uh, another um, Funko Pops. I want to see made video coming eventually. I'm <laughs> Those are always coming. Um, I got stickers. So I'm going to be sending out stickers to people. So, yeah. And I got more stuff coming. Uh, I, I know people have been trying to send me pops and stuff. And like I said, you don't have to send pops, but uh, not pops, but sending me packages. You don't have to send me anything, but anything anybody wants to send, I appreciate. So thank you. Um, what do you got coming up, Pop Team? Talk to me. Um, originally, I had that uh, retro thing and everything going on last week that I wanted to do, mm -hmm. but it involves reaction. And the way I normally do reaction has changed. So okay. I have to try and figure that out before I can film that. So I was really upset because I wanted to put it out. That so was a really awesome idea to have. Mm -hmm. Hopefully I can still do it. But now because the app I use, they've changed how the app works. Okay. So, yeah, if the the reaction videos sound plays, then my voice drowns. Okay. And it never used to be like this. I need to figure out the settings and that sort of thing. Um, okay. But, yeah. Hopefully, I'll still be able to get that out. This week, um, I've got the the matches recorded, some more wrestle coming out this week. Very entertaining week, I must say, um, from what I've actually watched of the matches. Uh, a few of them I just did. I did play, and I haven't watched it because I'm okay. thinking maybe it's going to give a better reaction when I watch it, maybe. So okay. we'll have to have a look. Um, but, yeah, that's coming out, four matches, uh, two long ones and two short ones. I can okay. confidently say. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's about it. If I can figure my way around that other video, I'll try and push that out as well. Yeah, I can't wait to see those. Oh, my goodness. Um, I, I said it earlier. If you guys didn't know, Mr. Techbot hit 1K. So go over and congratulate him for hitting his 1K. Uh, like, share, subscribe, show some love all over the place. Um, thank you guys for coming to hang out with us. Um, of course, next week. We're probably going to be doing another Funko Fair video because by next week, um, all the announcements should be out. So we'll be able to cover everything, not just these first couple days. Um, I might be doing a giveaway. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, I'm not going to say definitely, but um, 
maybe. Also, uh, Taco Pops. I got my interview with Taco Pops Sunday. Definitely. Mm. Um, we've, we haven't communicated since, but I'm sure we're still on. Um, don't forget to come check that out. Most of you guys will be asleep, so maybe you'll check the replay, but <laughs> I'm hoping. Yeah. If, if I'm awake, I think that's early morning for me, so I'll try and watch it live. That'll be really awesome. Yeah, it'll be early morning for you. So, yeah. Yeah. But anyway, um, yeah. thanks, Chase, for all the love, by the way, early on in the chat there. I think you said something. Yeah, Chase. Chase has been a, a big supporter. Um, really love yeah. that dude. He's his, his, his. Listen, go to Chase's kingdom. Check out his videos. Listen, you need to check his latest video out. It's freaking I'm going sick. to. I think I, I probably saw it, but I don't remember. Like I said, yesterday and the day before, I was like plowing through a lot of videos because I got behind on watching. And usually when I get behind, what I do is like I go to a video, I'll comment, I'll like it, I'll go to the next video, I'll comment, I like it because I'm trying. I want to show the love, I want to comment, I want to interact, I want you to get the view, and then so I probably went past it, but I would but, definitely um, take the time to watch it. Just just thinking now, um, another YouTuber I think you do watch him, um, Fet's Frequency. Yes, Fet. Fat, that's my dog. He's he does listen, man. Videos. He's one video. I don't know if it's his latest video now. I don't know if he's put one after that. Uh huh. Damn, it's good, good video, man. It's just okay. the video editing and the way it's done, absolutely class. Um, I don't, I don't think he's in the chat at the moment, but guys, head over and right, check that video out. You'll see what I mean when you watch it. Really, really sick. All right, so I'm, I'm writing the, both of those down. So I'm gonna check. We're really out. lucky to have right. such a community that makes such good videos, bro. Oh keeps yeah, us in, keeps us in a chase, bro. One one of the coolest things that I, about the Funko community is that everybody's really supportive. Like, I haven't met any like negative people so far. I mean, I'm pretty sure they're out there. I'm pretty sure there's some real sh shady characters. <laughs> I was gonna say the S word, but yes, shady, crappy shady. People. But so far, the people that I'm I'm in touch with that I communicate with like everybody's just seems so cool and so genuine so I really uh, I'm really happy that I stayed with it and I've told the story before uh, Wayne Cohen TechBot they kept me involved and you have said it before I kept you involved and I'm so glad that that like those series of events happened because look where we are now and I'm just I'm just enjoying this I, I love it so much and Honestly, like I hit the 400k, I mean 400 subs, and I'm happy that I got it. But I say it all the time. Honestly, I don't. I really wouldn't care if I had 400 subs or not. Like as long as I'm having fun, and I'm having fun, <laughs> mm. and I hope you guys are having fun. For yeah. sure. Okay. Yeah, for sure, for sure, for sure. <laughs> but um, hitting the big leagues, 400. Look at you, bro. Styling and profiling right yeah. there you'll get that 2000 or if definitely over yeah i'm, you'll, I'm, you'll get it. <laughs> I'm gonna push for it i mean the only reason i've really set the goal because i just for the saying i don't really care if i have the subs or not as long as i'm having fun doing this but in order for me to to really like improve the channel and do justice to the channel is to set a goal so i'm like all right i'm gonna set a goal for 2000 subs and the only way I'm going to get 2,000 stuff is by making videos and making good videos and expanding the brand of JKL also. Mm -hmm. So that's what I'm trying to do. So, well, you, see, the, <laughs> you see, with with me, you see, I'm good with it. I gave you the structure that I want to try and push or to get. Mm -hmm. If I'm 1,000, anything after, if I just literally sit on 1,001, for the next three years, I'm fine. If I yeah. open up the community tabs and all those things where I can share stories and share people's videos, yes, I'm a for away. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Anything thereafter is um, it's just gravy on top. Yeah, it's gravy. Yeah, yeah. That's kind of how I f how excuse me. That's kind of how I feel too. Like if I hit a thousand and I'm able to access the things that come with a thousand, like being able to do live streams from my phone when I'm out and about. And have the community tab and all the extra stuff. Yeah, I'm happy with that. That's that's pretty much like the short term goal. But mm. to really push myself to say, well, you know what? Let's really go for it. Yeah, I'm shooting for two. <laughs> but I'm for definitely sure. happy if I hit you up. 
Um, what's up, Kenneth? I'm glad you could show up. Listen, um, listen. Did you know what you did? Listen, you know what you did? What I do? You mentioned what you're possibly going to do next weekend, this guy. Oh! And this guy. <laughs> I said I'm gonna have. I might have a giveaway next week in Ken. This show, though, I swear, Ken, listen, you already won the giveaway. Congratulations! Does he? Does he smell it in the air? Like, look, guys, we're not plotted. Like, it's just how does this happen all the time? <laughs> if you're watching this on the replay, I literally did just mention, like, maybe five minutes ago, I might do a giveaway next week, and then Ken shows up. <laughs> That's just crazy. I mean, look, That's Ken is easier naturally every week. He is, guys fairness to him but i just think it's it's just so coincidental that he just yeah that he just showed up that's funny i didn't even think about it but yeah you are man tennis bro you got class, it class, <laughs> class, bro. Class. uh chase's kingdom yeah listen trust me I, I, i'm i'm here for you man i'm i'm happy that uh you passed 150 and you're at 184 you're almost at two i'm gonna help you get to two as much as i can i'm gonna help you happy what i got and i just keep trucking exactly doing what you do it's fun you know as long as it's fun it's not work it's not like okay i gotta do these videos or i gotta like put pressure on myself i'm having fun man that's what i'm that's what i'm about i like having fun so yeah and um speaking of giveaways i, I like i said i might do one next week it's going to be my 400 sub giveaway but it's just going to be for whoever's live if i do it so whoever's there, I'm not announcing it ahead of time. Like, hey, come to my 400 subscribe giveaway. No, if you were here on this video, you heard me say it. That's all the warning you're going to get. So if I do it next week, whoever's there, you're eligible. That's it. <laughs> Whoever shows up, I'm going to put them on the spinning wheel and give away a pop, 400 giveaway. <laughs> if I do it, if I might do. change my mind. We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So that's it. Um, we got to get out of here. Uh, well, I got to get out of here. Um, Pop T, if you want to stick around, you can stay in chat. I'm, I'm out. <laughs> I, 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 I unfortunately got ahead. It's just very. <laughs> uh, thanks to everybody who showed up. Thank you, Pop T. Um, we'll see you guys next week. We will. Thanks, thanks for showing up, guys. Enjoy. Mm -hmm.